in time. Uh, we picked up in the middle of a conversation um, where you guys had met and <laughs> uncovered the identity of oh, Celtic. Um, no. Rudolf von Richten. And uh, the party kind of had a conversation with him about what to do while Mikael uh, chased after Esmeralda and learned a little bit more about her and about their kind of common um, history. Uh, but uh, uh, you guys kind of not really set up a plan, but at least kind of started formulating one anyway um, of a few different um, potential uh, routes to take to continue to complete your objective. Uh, and decided that while under the protection of Strahd, it would be best to go talk to the Vistani when they could not openly be hostile. Um, so... Mikael and Esmeralda, having determined that, that would be your best bet, um, convince the rest of That's you uh, to head down to the Vistani camp. Why are you the way you are? Um, where uh, you guys came into a rather interesting uh, point in time, I guess would be an, a way to put it. Um... And uh, you guys kind of met some of the, uh, I guess, lack of a better term, uh, hmm, what's the word I'm looking for? I guess leaders, that's not really quite the word I'm looking for, um, of these Vistani, as well as meeting some of the or running into uh, some Dusk Elves, um, which are the only non-human people, aside from the Dwarf and Elf and the Abbot, um, that you guys have really seen here. Um, and as you walked through, um, you met uh, two of the... Uh, Vastani men, Luvash, and <clears throat> Aragal. As Luvash was in the middle of beating a man for letting his daughter be kidnapped. Hmm. After a tense conversation uh, between the party and them, uh, they let you go on your way under the ag agreement that you would keep your eyes out for Luvash's daughter. Um, and with a warning for Mikael. Uh, and at that point, we ended with you guys having choice. Whether you were going to go back and try to pursue finding this child, if you guys were going to go try to pursue finding the uh, mad mage, or if you guys were going to go to Castle Ravenloft uh, for the dinner invite from Strahd. All such good choices. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, <Yum. my> <laughs> of course. Everybody... But do you guys want more? There's definitely other side quests we can do. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Maybe we don't have all the side quests unlocked for us to choose from right now. It's so... just a land of side quests. You're not entirely wrong. <laughs> I, I, you're not. We gotta no, get I strong know. enough somehow. <laughs> <laughs> it's a land of fetch quests. 
Plenty of those, too. Every gamer's worst thing. Really? <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, at least there's no escort, but there definitely is. You, we're you still are courting. literally on we're one giant on escort, escort quest. Escort. We're still Somehow on an escort. We're still on an escort. Wheel. Wheel. <laughs> Thankfully, she walks the same speed as us. Thankfully. Mm -hmm. oh. That would be awful. <laughs> And she's hit slightly now. And now she can even now. hit and attack and do Yeah, something. wow. Yeah! Isn't that incredible? Okay. Where are we? Did we leave? Where are yeah, we? Did uh, we you guys yeah, are... did we leave? Yeah, we're I picking assume up we as you guys are kind of walking back toward town. Great. Walking okay. and talking. Uh, mm -hmm. okay. okay. Yeah, so for reference, I will so... give you the map. Yep. Thank you. I already have it saved. Um, yeah, so you guys are around here-ish. Aggressive. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Gotta get the Sorry. cat in. <laughs> Sorry. It's fine. Anyways. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it was just aggressively no. loud. I didn't right. mean to. I thought I muted before. I. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, it's wrong. <laughs> my cat's been trying to tunnel under my door lately, and it's oh my destroying my carpet. So, <laughs> anyway, Ooh. we're walking. We're walking mm -hmm. and talking. <laughs> yes. Uh huh. Yes, we are. What? I'm, I'm waiting for you guys to decide what you're doing. <laughs> right now, the choice as to which direction you guys are heading is yours. The bar. I'm kidding. God. No. We're gonna get no. drunk <laughs> again. We're gonna all on get more drunk night. Again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Every day. Every day. It's just. Drinks all around. How, I mean, that's how the Vistani deal with uh, Strahd. Clearly. Not wrong, bro. Okay. So what are we going to do? <laughs> How badly do we want to find this child that is missing? I just look towards Zila as you ask that. <laughs> Zila is definitely deep in thought. Um, we don't seem to have enough information on this kid. We don't... She had no friends. It's... If we had some sort of lead, we would know where to go, but we don't even know where to start looking. Do we ask I mean, somebody, like in the town? I don't know that anyone in the town would have any more information than... You know, her family would. Right? You, you ask in town about a little girl who's missing, they'll probably point you to the orphanage. Mm. Well, we've already been there, so... Yeah, but we never looked for a... Oh, wow, that was the wrong accent. We never <laughs> looked for a... For a, a, a... Well, the daughter of a nearby village. I mean... We don't really have a lead, you're right. But we could always, I don't know, take a look around the surrounding areas, see if we found something before we went off to wherever we're going next. Could we search the nearby forest? Is that unwise? It would be unwise, certainly. Just, we could do it if we wanted to. If there are there, there tracks or anything, we may be able to find them then. I guess it. Are you suggesting the lake? It's as close. I mean, I just sort of meant anywhere nearby. But yeah, maybe the lake. It would not hurt to just go around the whole area. You could take a day, try to. Look for traps, look for leads. Tracks, rather. And also if we tracks. don't find anything, then... We're in the same position as before. 
or we could not waste time. If we think it would be a waste. Well, personally, while we have this immunity from danger, it might be wise to do it now versus like that after we go to the dinner and it is revoked from us. It's true, actually. The forest is probably safer now than any other time. You mm. know, the longer... Strut, so, like, you know, we're still going that way. Alright, so, it's settled. We're going to the forest. Let's not, um... Waste time. Agreed. Okay. Fine by me, but... I don't think we should try to get ourselves much more distracted. I've, uh... I've got a feeling if we take advantage of this too much, he's going to revoke those privileges, as well as my life privilege. Oh, definitely. We should not do this for too much longer. Like, I would not want to go to the whatever wizard place we were going to go yet, just because... He didn't it's, like, give us a deadline when he talked to us. I think Arjun is right. We shouldn't seem rude. Perhaps. We shouldn't abuse it, but... Taking a little bit of advantage of it, probably fine. I'm sure if he doesn't like it, then me and Zila will hear him talk to us. Maybe. If we take another day, I don't think that will, you know. I'm sure one more day wouldn't hurt, but... I just don't want to spend another day, and another day, and another day, and so on and so forth. Right, I, no. I Let's set a heart agree. limit. We look for the girl today, we see what we find. And then, in the morning, we go to the castle. Yes? No? Sounds, Sounds good. good to me. Yeah, alright. As much as the plan as any. Okay. We All search right. the forest, DM. Uh, so where about here? Let me bring up the map of Corovia. It looks like it's a bigger map. Oh, yeah. Boop. So we are in Valaki. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My thought yeah, was. So you guys. To kind of go like below the like south forest of like where Valaki is and like kind of wind our way eastward, you know, like on the edge maybe. See if we can't find any tracks or anything. Anything. At all, or definitely anything. anything. Yeah. Yeah. So. Did you want to look at the there... lake, Sila? It was just a thought. We could go check there and then the forest because the forest is going to be sure. a bit harder. We could just do a circle. Lucky, so, I mean, sure. yeah. Alright. Mm. So, which way are we going? We. You guys are going to the lake. Mm -hmm. No? Yes. Yes. The token is on the map if you guys can see it. Yeah. To the lake. Maybe start lake and then move on to the forest. Okay. Yeah, sounds like a plan. Cool. All right. <clears throat> As you guys are walking up, at the foot of a mountain nestled in the misty forest is a large lake. The water is perfectly still and dark, reflecting the clouds and the mist overhead like a mirror. Pulled up along the south shore are three small rowboats. A fourth can be seen in the middle of the lake with a lone figure sitting in it, fishing pole in hand. Is he doing anything? With a fishing pole in hand. Well, I mean... <laughs> Right. Okay, is he just sitting there? Or yeah, you know? yeah. I mean, is he actually 
fishing yes. or is he's, he just kind of walking around? He's, around. Yeah. Yeah. he's in a boat in the middle of a lake <laughs> with a fishing. fishing pole. He's okay. fishing. <laughs> oh. Right. Uh, I'll be a little more specific with my questions. Right. Yes. He is in the middle of the lake on a boat <gasps> with a fishing pole fishing. What is he fishing? <laughs> is he reading a book? <laughs> How does the water yeah, look? Maybe does he's just like sunning himself. Active yeah. with fish or whatever. Uh, it doesn't appear to be. It is completely still. Wait, the boat's not even making little waves? Nope. Okay, that's not creepy. Great! That is creepy. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's normal. Does it look like he's caught any fish? It's too hard to tell. He's several hundred feet out to the middle of the lake. To, yeah, to put it in perspective, this lake is a good half mile across. Okay. Um, he's about in the middle of it. Uh, he's a good four or five hundred feet from shore. Is he the only boat? He is the There's only boat on, on the, the lake. Beach. There are three okay. boats next to the lake. Like yeah, tied yeah. up. Sorry, I meant out on the okay. Yeah, yeah. Um, out on the lake, he is the only one. Is there anything else on the beach? Is there like a little any, any other people? Fish or hot or nope, any there tracks is or weirdness nothing. in this in the mud, sand question mark? Uh no, there's not. There seems to be just a single track of footprints out to where presumably that boat was moored. Mm. <laughs> There's only one solution, guys. Hello. Right. <laughs> this is a terrible idea. I was about to do it if you weren't. <laughs> Nothing. No response. Not even a look over. Nope. I yell louder. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. I yell as loud as I right? can. <laughs> There's a 19 performance for yelling. Yeah. It's pretty loud. <laughs> and Very loud. still no. great. Nothing. Cool. Cool. I reiterate. Are we good at boats? Um, can anybody do a boat and we can go out on the lake? We'll see him. Do a boat. Uh, how many how, DM? How many people does a boat hold? Um, they look like they'd hold four to five average-sized people. Should we take two boats? Tweet. What are we hoping to accomplish what are we, by getting yeah. in a boat? Wait, what You're are we doing? Us, which is rude. <laughs> well, I, to be fair, He's there's just living his you. life. Well, I mean, he is the only person here. So if there was a child, he, but then again, he doesn't even notice us. So how, why would he notice a child? I don't know. D does he not notice us or is he ignoring us? I don't know. Uh, I'll have to go ask uh, both are I'll be right back. Possible. I cast fly on myself. Oh, oh shit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Do it. <laughs> okay, Spitch so I uh, so how far away is he from shore? Uh he's about four hundred ish feet from the shore. Okay, so if I Double move and everything. I'll definitely get there before 10 mi minutes is up. Just fine. Okay, cool. I would like to fly. I want to start with 30 feet up in the air. And then however many rounds it takes for me to get within a good viewing distance, but not too close of the boat. Well, you can double fly too, right? You can double move. So, Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Okay. Am I making sense, DM? I don't want to get too close just yet. <laughs> okay. But I um, want to be close enough to see what's going on in better detail. Okay. Uh, yeah, you can begin to get close. I'd say 
when you're probably hmm, maybe a hundred or so feet, uh, you can start kind of making out more details. I mean, obviously, as you get closer, but okay. So, um, starting at the hundred feet, what can I tell with a sixteen? It looks like a dude in a fishing boat fishing. Um, is there you anything? You do not see any fish in the boat. You see some empty bottles. Mm. I would. Okay, the features of the man. Is he like covered in a trench coat? Uh, nope. So this man, as you pull up. Uh, as you pull up, <laughs> just pull on up here. Um, as you fly up, um, he looks to be kind of middle aged, um, and seems to be in not the cleanest of, um, not the cleanest of clothing. Uh-huh. Um, and with a very kind of scraggly beard, kind of longer unkempt hair. Uh-huh. And is just hunched over fishing. I'm looking for emaciation, sir. <laughs> I'm looking uh, to he... see if I'm looking at a skeleton with no. that is nope. ridiculously like preserved. This... Nope, this looks like a man. <laughs> cool. He does not look skeleton. He does not look emaciated. He looks okay. like the average person. Okay, I'm not saying anything yet. Um, the And you said the boat itself isn't making any rocking at all in the water. As you get closer, you can see a little bit as the guy kind of you know, moves the rod a little bit. You see a little bit of wiggling now that you're closer. Okay. It's subtle <laughs> movements, but it's not... He wasn't, like, actively rowing or moving drastically to make a bunch of, you know, ripples and things that you guys could see from that far away until you got closer. Okay, so he's definitely fishing. All right, cool, great. Um... Can I see that far below the lake's surface? I imagine uh, not. No, but... the lake uh, the lake is very dark. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, so it looks like he's moving, quote unquote, like fidgeting every so often. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, because, you know, even as hard as you try to sit still, you kind of move a little bit because it just gets uncomfortable. So he's just the, the slightest of movements, kind of wiggling the rod a little bit to, you know, jiggle the bait and whatnot. Uh huh. I'm gonna make a wisdom check real quick. Okay. Ah, yes, okay. <laughs> This um, is interesting. Please continue. <laughs> I wish to see what this result is. Has he caught any fish yet? Do I hear her? Um, I would imagine if she's yelling at you, you can you, you can hear reasonably. Plus, you're not right up next to him yet, so yeah, I'd say you could reasonably hear. You might Zilla be a little quiet. Zila crosses her arms. <laughs> And, so, and and I will use thaumaturgy with this. This is not concentration. It just is. Um, yeah, fine, so I can still fly. I can still fly. We're trying to talk to you. He does not respond. No, he hasn't caught any fish. Well, that is a pity. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Genanigans. Uh, <laughs> hold on. Let me see what I can do. I'm, I'm here for it. 
Okay, with this power... Uh, it's a hundred... How much do I think he weighs? <laughs> I'd say... Give me a... Uh, yeah. per <laughs> perception? Perception! I have a question. Why? Uh, oh, never mind. We're good. Never mind. I answered my own question to myself. Ha ha! <laughs> he probably is like. Hmm. I'd say he's probably one. 70, 180. He's Along a, with he's... the boat? With the boat? Yeah. You're looking at probably closer to 300 or okay, so? Okay, I can't afford that. <laughs> <laughs> Too rich for Solid Madeline. wood boat. It's heavy. <laughs> yeah, I they're can't They're designed to hold that. up to five people, so they're big. Makes sense. I can't afford that. Wait, the boat is 300 pounds? No. Him plus oh. the boat. Okay, okay. So that's the boat's fair. probably that's fair. That's fair. 120 the lure is in the to water, 130. Yeah? Yeah, yes, yeah, the lure is in... Presumably. It looks like it is. Uh, Are we sure I... it's even water at this point? <laughs> There's a reason the why I'm still flying, water? sir. <laughs> okay, two people talked, which... <laughs> <laughs> She's still fine. Uh, I, I went into I went into like the water bank to see if it's still water. If it's actually it is water. It is actually yep, it's water. water. It's cold, but it it's is water. Cold water. Not good water. Not like so, that sun. That was nice. Ooh. Would you oh. allow me to use my telekinetic hands to pick the lure and the the string out of the water? <laughs> <laughs> sure. <laughs> I do that. Uh, I want to see the reaction. Okay, you do that. He doesn't react at all. Okay, can I see his eyes? Uh, I mean, if you're to the point where you can grab his bobber and such, yeah, you can see his I, eyes. I want to say telekinetic hands is within 30 feet. Yeah, yeah so you, you're feet. close enough. You could probably. Do they see his eyes? Glazed over. Does does he? Uh... Um. I shall hydrate, Roll. sir. Thank you. I do have water here. I will need to get more soon, though. Mm. Investigation, Arcana. <laughs> 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 Roll investigation. Hey That's probably the best option for this. There you go. That's good. Um, so they don't look glazed over in like a he is controlled or he is dead or anything of that nature. Uh, but they appear glazed over in the fact that he's zoned out. Like, it does not look like he is actively paying any attention to what is happening. Hmm. 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 Be aggressive. Be, be aggressive. <laughs> I'm trying to see what I have in my... I don't... I do have some. I take out the bottle of wine and I float it over and just wiggle it in front of his face. With my mind, of course. Telekinetic hands allows me to do this. How close do you get to him? Me, myself, I don't go any closer. No, the, the bottle the wine. goes within. The bottle is <laughs> in front of his face trying to get his attention. <laughs> uh, roll me a dexterity check. <laughs> what? Yeah. Dexterity he's, save? He's trying to grab check. the bottle. 
check. Uh, please DM, I am new. Check means ability or save. Ability. Check. Thank you. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why do you have the one? Oh, because you're thing them above, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, you successfully move it out of the way as he tries to grab it. Okay, you are there. Hello, respond. Uh, he looks up at you, and then goes back to looking down at the fishing rod. I fly back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I land. He's so interested in wine. Plan? He won't tell me, but he's definitely alive and definitely a person who's very interested in wine. And as I stow it away, I look at Sophie, making sure she doesn't try to grab it. Something. Okay. I mean, do we want to try to, like, bribe him with it? We could row out there and, you know, be like, I hey, mean, you see anything? You hear anything? Uh -huh. We'll look at the swine. We'll give it to you. <laughs> no. Sure. I, attempts it, I attempted something similar. He didn't want to talk. I mean, you didn't talk to him. You just kind of held it in front of his face, right? <laughs> no offense. I don't know. I'm not great with people. What do you want? I with with. I'm just saying. All together, he might have to talk to us because it is more threatening if there is like. Eight sure. there, you know? It doesn't even have to be all of us. I think trying to get eight people on like two robots would be sort of <laughs> a whole thing. There are three Sounds robots. Like oh, okay, I'm sorry. There are three robots. Less of a challenge. I guess if we all want to <laughs> load up on three separate robots. Is there anything we should be worried about with this lake? Is there anything they should be, we should be worried about with this lake? Uh, Go ahead and roll me... Survival. Oh, that's nice for you. <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. It's oh, but I still don't water. know. <laughs> You're not sure. You don't really know much about it. <clears throat> Never really had much of a reason to come over here. It's a lake, as far as I know. What do the NPCs know? Yeah, what do the NPCs uh, know? <laughs> great question. Let's find out. This is going to go so well for Irina. Oh, she'll roll Surely good. Esmeralda knows about any lake monsters. Surely Irina, who is of this land. So knowledgeable <laughs> about the land of Barovia. Huh. A Irina, hunter. roll the natural yeah. one for a zero. Oh, that's my girl. Oh, I yeah. love it. I love I'm it. Like, no, par for the course. Me. Yep. <laughs> um... And Esmeralda rolled an 11. We all know a ton uh, about this lake. Seven. Cool. 11's more than a I 7. Don't know, I don't really know much nah. about this lake. It is a lake. Look. I know people came here to fish. That's about it. Obviously, well, gestures to man fishing. fishing. He's doing it right now. Hey, you asked what I know. I answered you. What more do you want? I've never been to this lake, and I can tell you at least a person fishes here. Well. What else do you do at a lake? I think fishing is Swim? Rough, but he's caught no fish yet. Is it really fishing? Have you felt the water? It's cold. I didn't say in this lake. You just said at a lake. <laughs> okay, semantics. I have felt the water, and it is indeed cold. Okay. How about this? I'm going to get in this boat. Does someone want to come you. with me? Coming with you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm with you. I'll join you. I want to go in the okay. boat. Okay. We're all going to get in the boat. The NPCs can get in a different boat if they want to. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'll be in the boat. They're with going the to NPCs. just stay at the shore because oh, there's not really. <laughs> there are three boats. I don't think I, I have that fly much last. time. I don't remember. I don't think I don't think I have that much time left on flying okay. after all Never of mind. that. Never mind. Sorry. Yeah, <laughs> I would say by the time you got minute. out there and you kind of cautiously did things and came back, you'd be you'd only have maybe another <coughs> minute or two. 
Yeah, and that is an expensive sell, guys. Oh, yeah, no, yeah. I know. Um, the NPCs, I mean, there's not really... They don't, don't see need much them of a reason to. to go out there. <laughs> Um, I think this guy gonna let you guys handle I want to check like, him out. There's not really any danger right now, so there's not a reason <laughs> for us to go out there. He's not gonna fucking Are there do fishing it. poles by the boat? Like, by the boats, too, or just the boats? Uh, no, it's just the boats. Sad. Damn, um, we're going to do, um, um, I'm blanking on her name. Actually, roll investigation check. Okay. <laughs> I'm so good at those. Estelle! We were going to do Estelle proud! Oh, I'm good, that was Uh, you don't find any any rods, but you do find a net. Okay, I'm, net. I'm bringing it with. Bringing cool. It with. Okay. Can have with okay. Fair enough. Is it like a, right. a tossing net or one of those ones on the stick? No, it's like the, the like the big, like yeah. bring, bringing in yeah. bunches of fish. Like a I fishing get in net. The... I get in a boat right. and I start rowing. <laughs> With all right, join you. <laughs> yeah. All right, so are you all going in one boat? You said that it holds up to four people. You could hold up to five. Okay, Ooh. then we're all going, I guess. There we go. We all get in the boat. All right, <laughs> we all pile Great. in. You all get into a boat. The NPC <laughs> stay on shore. Great, it's fine. Normal. Um, yeah, totally normal. Um. I we'll mean, do right you really back. want Basilka to stand in a boat? No. Like, let's be honest no. here. That's uh, to be maybe unfortunate if the boat we don't need to do that to her. Um, she looks like she's very heavy. Yeah. Um, <laughs> what are you saying about? Fast, but you know, uh, she's she's golem. very built muscular wise. She's strong. Mm. So probably golems are very dense. heavy. Yeah. Um, we'll be right back. <laughs> Okay. I'm not talking to this man. <laughs> I'm not talking to this man. Uh, so you guys start to row your way out there with a net. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, and begin to make your way uh, out uh, to the middle of the shore. Right around the A. Cool. As we're getting rowed out there, I'd like to throw the net out. Mm -hmm. We might as well see if we can catch anything. I'm assisting. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um... I'm gonna grab a drink. La hmm. Okay. I mean, it's easy enough to throw the thing out. Maybe when you roll actually try net. to bring anything in, we might have to roll for it. But throw a net out. Not the other. All right. You guys can kind of are you kind of trolling it behind you as you go? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm just trying to see positions of things. Okay. Uh, so you guys can begin to make your way out there. Are you guys just going straight up to his boat? Yeah. All right. Are you going up behind him? Or are you going to go around front of him, side of I'm him? I'm just going directly to the side. I assume he's kind of parallel to the shore. I don't know. Yeah. Yep. So then he. If you picture it, he is parallel to the shore. Yeah. And he is... The the pole is to one side, but he's kind of facing the front of the boat. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Just kind of pull up... Okay. Kind of parallel <laughs> so, to, to his him. side. Yeah, parallel to him. Does that make sense? Mm hmm Seems like a good position for talking. All right. Uh, so, yeah, you guys get out there a couple minutes. Um... It's not too difficult. The water's calm, so you're not fighting against it. Um, you guys can make your way up there. As you approach, you see the same kind of personality, same description what, yeah. as what uh, Zila saw when she pulled up. I would have told them, too. Yeah. Okay. We get up next to him. No issue. Mm -hmm. Hello. He says nothing or acknowledges yep. you. Okay. Who's got the boost? <laughs> uh, 
Wait, Dila I've got the knife. back out. Oh. And then okay. she, Jesus Christ. this time, this time I just ring the side of it with like the dagger just to make, you know, the chime sound of a uh, wine mm -hmm. bottle. Okay. Um, as you, as you do that, um, he does turn and look in that direction. Still not super acknowledging you, but he does at least look in the direction. Are you able to talk? Like, do you, can you speak? Um, he does not appear to respond in any way. He is just staring at the bottle. You can have this if you talk with us. He just continues to stare at the bottle. His boat just has, like, empty bottles and nothing else in it. Yep. I don't suppose any of us could read his mind. I don't know how to do that. Do you know how to do that? Not my skills. Oh, nope. <laughs> I have an idea. Harrigen stands up, leans over the boat, and dives under the water. Uh, Harrigen, okay. Can you swim? Uh, DM, I turn into a fish with one of my wild shapes. <laughs> yeah. All right. <laughs> All right. Yay! He can swim now. Druid yes, he can swim. Just, I do druid Joey. things. Yes. Give me a perception check. Uh -huh. <laughs> I am... Scared. <laughs> yeah, as you should be. Why do you be. think oh. I wouldn't want to be anywhere near the close of the surface of this water? Mm. Oh, oh, and of course gosh. I roll a three? Uh, for a 13? Hold on. Let's... That's still pretty good for a three, though. Yeah, a 13. I mean, yeah, it's a, it's a 13. Okay, what kind of fish are you turning into? Let's see if there's any additional things that can come with <laughs> the fish. Okay. Their perception um... fish. <laughs> A well, it it's you never cold, know. and it's a big lake. Uh, I'm not a fisherman, so the only thing I could think of is a catfish. Not a terrible idea. No. Um, let me see if I can find a catfish. They like cold water better than warm water, so. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, uh, when you wild shape, uh, oh, but there are like benefits to, mm -hmm. to certain yeah, animals. I, I was thinking like it doesn't animal, it doesn't I'm looking change. I'm at one called a quipper. A quipper. A yeah, it pipe. sounds. Uh, it kind of sounds like um, a different like take teeth, on. Course, sort of catfish, yeah, you know. Wait, uh, I I have a fun idea. Um, DM, did I see not any fish water. in the net? Uh, you did not. In oh, net? okay. Yeah. Well, shit. I guess we suck at yeah. fishing. Yeah, Quipper seems to be kind of along the line of a piranha. Oh. Oh. Yeah, this is... Interesting. A uh, giant catfish. <laughs> giant that catfish. Giant. Yeah, that's Catfish. Five E. Let's see I this. Love it. I'm uh, it's to a find CR one. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to find the uh, stat block. I still love it. <laughs> Megan, it's Adam slippery. <laughs> the catfish has advantage on ability no. checks and saving throws made to escape a grapple. You could be a crab. Crab. Oh. Crab can I, can crab I swimming, swim, swim as a crab? Crab swim! They have a swim Depending speed, though. On the crab. Yeah, that's the other thing. Apparently a giant catfish has blind sight 10 feet. <laughs> Sick. Hmm. How did that get blind sight, but a cat doesn't? It, it also sense. has dark vision 60 feet. The catfish is obviously superior. Look, I was discussing CRs with Ghost Cat doesn't the even other have day. dark vision. CRs are bullshit. Cats don't even have dark vision. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. it's oh, server. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. Oh. Oh. Well, Ghost has gone too, go I bet. Oh, uh, yeah. That One sounds like a. Been paused there. I have no idea. That's a good time for BRB. <laughs>
Well, I mean, it was your computer <laughs> earlier, wasn't it? With the USB yes. stuff? Yes. Yes, but this was actually, like, my modem and router. Uh, it was not the computer. Like, all of my internet just killed okay. itself. Let me, let me, re let me revise my statement. Technology hates you. Mm. That's a good way. Yes, that's, that's a good, a good explanation. Um, it's because it knows I've been working with Max and it's jealous. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Even though it's not my choice. Uh... All right, let's see. Uh, let us reload in. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I'm still looking at animals, so because since it crashed, <laughs> all of my stuff crashed. Mm -hmm. uh. Fun. Well, welcome to being a druid. <laughs> yeah. At least I do the research into the monsters, the the beasties, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I get them. I get I'm them sure ahead of time. Like yeah, I, days, Joey. But, you know, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I forgot that I could become uh, uh, water uh, animals now, and it just kind of dawned on me because you know we're at a lake. Mm -hmm. It was. Um, uh, what about like other ones? Like sometimes you know, being a druid is being in a situation like and realizing. Usually. Well, yeah. oh, I can wild shape. <laughs> to be fair, alligator, or crocodile. Mira sent seal. me hers. It was the night of or the day after you found out you were going to the plane of water. I think that's a, you know, good idea and hint that she might want a fish. That's a pretty, you know, yeah. <laughs> time to get it's some it's fish ready. I had a choice of like water animal before, but knowing all that I know now, I know there's a great wide world of stuff. And I'm like, I... And also being able to have the ability to wild shape you guys. I want to give you guys options. <laughs> mm hmm Okay. Yeah. So. Oh, it's large. Unfortunately, killer whale is not one of the options because I can't seem to roll as Nash. <laughs> yeah, the, it was a 50-50. Good chance on a D100. You know? I rolled a fucking 29, man. <laughs> <laughs> like, Sounds about right. Mm -hmm. Some of these roles I do for animals, Chris, would be great for divine intervention mm -hmm. for clerics. <laughs> like, I, I, I think I've even rolled like a five once. <laughs> nice. Speaking of rolling for animals, DM, could I roll for the giant bunny real quick? Okay, roll for the giant bunny. Thank you. No. Uh, 28. <laughs> no. Oh. Hey, that's it's my so mom, sad. My you keep trying it so and it keeps failing. Yeah, <laughs> it's so <that's>... sad. <laughs> uh, Want to be a giant rabbit? Giant rabbit. Oh, she's All never looked in the mirror. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> a giant bunny. Giant bunny. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Did I accidentally uh, reference something? Yes. <laughs> All I want to do Sick. is see you turn into, see you turn into a, giant a giant woman. woman. Giant woman. Giant woman. Steven Universe. Mm -hmm. well, that's a good one. <laughs> you want me to roll for you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm giving you options, oh, and then you, very good. <laughs> and then you need to tell me what you Joey, want. So we can oh my god, octopus. I'm sitting Be here like uh, the DM's gonna find a fish he finds appropriate for me. Uh uh, you're I'm the player. You the options Dude, for them. You're the player. I, I have, you to, have do to do roll research for mine. it. Check them out. No, man. I am. I am so sorry. I just wasted so much <laughs> time. You're right. fine. You're fine. Yep. Okay. I can't. Uh, I can't access the. Uh oh. Let me here. There you go. What CR can you do? Up oh wait, yeah, be an octopus, dude. Yeah. I have a CR of one now. Yeah, octopus. No, is zero. one half, right? Dude, dude, oh dude, trust, trust. See, octopus, do it. Fourth, I have a CR of one half. Yeah. And yeah, 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 yeah. octopus, octopus. octopus. Octopus is zero. Octopus is zero, but they have really good stuff. Okay. Um, 
Do you have a number in mind? I do. It's not difficult. All right, watch me fail. Oh, oh. Hey, you beat it. Look at that. Hey! hey. It was uh, not going to be hard. CR zero. Like, it's not going to be super difficult <laughs> to have seen an octopus. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yes! <laughs> it's good. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Trust us, huh. an octopus can do work. <laughs> okay, I have the octopus. That's cool. Uh, I want to see if I can find cat. Actually, giant catfish. I was looking at this one. Cat. CR1. Fish. It's a CR1. It? Oh, fuck. CR1. Damn it. All right. Um, What about like a, like a cod? 5e. You of course, I'm getting. Cod. Um, fish. Let me check my, let me check my aminals that I sent, Chris. I might have many, a so right many. Now. I have so many guys. I have options, options for days. Uh, uh what's a giant seahorse? Giant seahorse is CR one, I think. No, uh, CR one half. Oh, it's CR one, one half, half. So he could do it. Yeah. Do you want to try to roll for that, Joey? Sure. You could also roll for a base seahorse too. Okay. I will. I will give it to you. What All about right. a crocodile? Oh, uh, yeah, that is one that I do want to roll for. Actually, hold on. Let me check the list. You might have already had Crocodile. I kind of wondered about that, too. Let me double check the notes. I think I have it written down here. You have Crocodile yeah. already. I do there have Crocodile. Go. Yes, it's on the it's on the list of ones that we've rolled for already. Yeah. Crocodile. Okay, uh, you know what, what if I just do fish, <laughs> I'd be. Too generic. Yeah, it is. Damn it. Well, I'll roll for the quipper. Quipper's CR zero, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There goes Yo, my good roll. Yes. Yeah, on a 92. Yeah. Yep, you saw it. I, yeah. That was going to no, be a harder it, it one. It actually but... bit me. <laughs> yeah, on a 92, you've seen one. I, that yeah. was going to be hard because that's a decent sized creature. <laughs> decent size? It's yeah, a large. It's, really... it's tiny. No, it's a large. The no, quipper? quippers are large. I'm looking at the thing right now. It says tiny beast. It's got one HP. What? Send me what you're looking at, and I'll send you what I'm looking at, and what I think okay. Mira is looking at. All oh, right. Yeah, no, the one on Roll20.net is uh, a tiny beast. One HP. Oh, weird. D&D Beyond, one. too. Yeah, D &D the Wiki one that you sent me off. is one HP as well. Why is this? Why is it a large beast with one HP? <laughs> what sense does that make? I think it should be a tiny beast if it's gonna yeah, have one no, HP. Yeah, no, it should be tiny. Yeah. Because they're supposed. To, I was like, they're, they're supposed to have like swimming packs and things. I was like, if you have a bunch of large beasts swimming at you in a pack, are that's you looking at like terrifying a swarm yeah. stat or something? I don't know. Yeah, don't they don't look actually. Uh, no. All right. Um, I'm gonna. Sorry for taking everyone's time for this. Uh, I'm going to shape wild shape into a quipper. Um, okay. You wild shape into a very tiny little, little beast, little thingy, a little fish. And uh, little fish. do I uh, on a thirteen? Do I see anything with that? Perception check. Uh oh, they're terrifying looking. Uh, yeah, they are. yeah, like I said, they're related to piranhas. <laughs> they're creepy looking. Um, hmm. 
how far down are you trying to go? Oh, I'm not trying to go far down at all. I wouldn't Just even down. go further than like five feet, I think. That deep? I no, know. not with that perception. Okay. Um, I want to find the 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 fishing hook, and I want to bite it. <laughs> okay. Uh, take four points of damage as the hook hooks your jaw. Yay! <laughs> Great job. <laughs> um, and now you're <laughs> stuck on a hook. And a rabbit. And a rabbit now because he had And also a rabbit with a jaw through your hook. Or a hook through your jaw. A jaw through your hook? <laughs> you, you now have a hook. I I don't okay. know your jaw. What okay. you? <laughs> no, no. Listen, listen. I know that it makes sense that I take damage biting a hook or whatever, but like a fish doesn't just die the second they bite a fishing hook. You're correct, but D and D fish, yeah, D and D yeah. wild shapes are not quite the no, same. No, it makes sense. No, I understand, but <laughs> like I wasn't thinking in those terms. I understand you <laughs> were. Is... I. I get it. Yeah. I understand entirely uh, what your argument is. I completely I do. I love wild shape yep. shenanigans. If it would have only done oh one, God. I wouldn't have cared. It's the fact that it rolled four that I was like, okay, I can't just fudge. Yeah. <laughs> that's, yeah. that's too much to fudge. I have a question. <laughs> While he's underwater having a hook through his jaw, obviously the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the fishing rod will, you know, dip a little. Does he react? The fishing rod actually dips quite a bit. Fun fact, Joey. Uh, look at your... Uh, yes, I already know. I'm not ability. worried. You're <laughs> yep. fine. Oh, yeah. Uh, completely. Yeah. Um, I'm just chilling. It's a little cold. He's... Yeah. <laughs> I have a hook Damn in my tears, mouth. Man. It's cold. They've, they've got some fun things that uh, come into play in a scenario like this. <laughs> okay. Um, so... Does Are you okay? Well, it depends on do you when that happens, do you try to swim back up or are you just gonna let yourself sink with the thing? This is what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take the wire, I'm going to wrap it around my hand a little bit that way, uh huh. It doesn't, you know, yep, do yep, anything. I get it. I'm gonna spend a moment to take <laughs> it out of my lip. That's a good idea. <laughs> yeah. And uh, I'm going to just kind of like pretend like I'm a fish and, and, and jiggle the fishing rod. Okay. Um, so those of you up above the water, mm -hmm. uh, you see the initial bite and the, the rod move. And then you see it for a second get much heavier before it comes back up. Um, and then you see it kind of bobbing up and down as if a fish has caught it. Um, he doesn't react. You know, there's a fish in your line. You probably should get the fish out of the water if you want to catch it. Um, at that, he will, he will look back at it and, uh, are you going to try to resist him pulling the rod up? Are you going to try and pull him down? I want to. <laughs> it's up oh, to you. Whatever to. you want to do. The devil on your shoulder is screaming, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. You know what? This guy's completely unresponsive. I'm going to be a little bit of a dick. <laughs> All right. Give me a... Give me either athletics or acrobatics. You're dexterous enough and you can you don't have to breathe. So you're not struggling against holding your breath. Wait, why doesn't he have to breathe? Dampier. Dampiers do not Dampier. require breath. Oh. Yeah. Yep. So Fine. technically he didn't even need to change into anything. <laughs> he no, but I thought it would by. be funny if I bit no, the hook, I, he pulled I, me I up, and then I go, poof, <laughs> I'm actually a rabbit, not Trust a fish. Me. <laughs> it would have been hilarious. I know what you were <sighs> going for. It just unfortunately didn't work. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. But I, I feel like this is the I knew what you were napkin. doing. I thought it was funny. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, Thank you. I you tried. you pull on uh the thing. Let's see. I'm gonna have him make a deck save to see if he gets <laughs> even though it's a nat 20 because checks and things don't always count as success. He goes over having lost on a 21. Um, um should we help him? He swim. <laughs> um Is he trying to swim? What is he doing? That's a more important question. Okay, mm -hmm. hold on. So, let me I'm going to roll this and see okay the boat stays upright um he just goes over the side the boat rocks back flat um he for a moment you don't see anything and then you begin to see kind of flailing um from coming like up through the water and oh he pops his head up and looks more clarity than he had. He still doesn't look necessarily all the way there, um, but he looks like he's more there than he was. Is he close enough? Can I, like, just scoop him? Yeah, because this would have been... <laughs> like, this. you guys are probably only... Close, five right? or six like, feet apart yeah. and he went over between the two of your boats so yeah you could feasibly reach down and grab a hold of him um, are you Can pulling try him to... up into the boat or... i was gonna try to i mean it sounds like actually we're farther apart than i thought so i can't put him in his own boat probably so um... i guess i'll just put him in ours <laughs> i mean you make you couldn't couldn't necessarily ride away, but there's nothing to say that you couldn't like grab like by the collar, get a little closer, and then lift him That's up. That's sort of own, yeah, or help okay. him into his own boat. There's no reason you couldn't. It's not combat, so there's no reason you can't do things like that. Okay, that's what I'm doing. Then. <laughs> okay, yeah, so you can kind of help him up into his own boat. Yeah, um, kind of giving him a preventing a drowning. <laughs> yeah, yeah, um, yeah, and uh, once you do that, he kind of shakes off a little bit um and uh begins to try to rummage around through the bottles to presumably find one um, hey, and hey. after no success <laughs> <laughs> sits down again are you okay could i get his attention when he was like still um, lucid ish once you got done yeah i i mean he's still somewhat lucid like he didn't yeah. go back to instantly not there um, so yeah, you could get his attention. He'll at least look over towards your direction. <clears throat> hey, listen. We've been looking for a Vistani kid. Have you seen one? Little girl? Like, seven, probably. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Have you... Zela will hold the bottle up and just shake it around like... You know... You can have this if you give us good information. Uh. <clears throat> what does it look like? Little girl. Do we have a description for her, actually? Right? We have a description. Okay. Yeah. One uh, Luvash the... gave you a yeah, rough right. description. Black hair, you know, like... Yeah, black okay. hair. I give the description. Younger she's child. A little, she's young. She's black hair. She's a girl. She's Vistani. Give us I... anything, man. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. He seems to be telling the truth. 
You haven't seen her at all. Not even a little bit. Have you heard anything about her? You know, a kid I, missing? Yeah, I heard Anyone else talking? children. They live in the camp. Okay. One is not there anymore? Not in the camp. I don't know nothing. You don't know nothing? That seems about the I rolled a 17 off the board, damn it. <laughs> uh, <coughs> with the 18s, mm -hmm. um, it appears like he's maybe not telling the whole truth. I think you do know something. I don't know what you're talking about. Perhaps you would like another dip in the lake? I was just about to threaten the same thing. Hold. <laughs> it could be worse. What's colder is holding information about a little girl who's missing from a father who is very worried about her. I don't know she's missing. We just said she's missing. Did you? Yes. Multiple times. Mm -hmm. Oh. I need another drink. Mm, no. Not Maybe yet. if you tell us what you know, huh? Sorry, I can keep a straight face while I'm doing this character. Plug, <laughs> <laughs> okay. it's your turn to be drunk. Uh -huh. <laughs> it is. And it's I. Oh, it's like playing Duke Dunan when he was drunk. Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't keep a straight face when I'm playing a drunk character. It's so funny to me. I drink first. Drink after. Oh. Perhaps we go to shore and talk without potentially falling over, too. I think we should stay right here. I don't know where my rod fishing rod went. There's the fishing rod in front of him. <laughs> Um, that depends on if Harrigan has it down under the water with him. Or no, I took that water. thing with me. <laughs> uh, no, it is not. It is under the water with Harrigan. It's gone. <laughs> Seems like you lost your fish. Aww. Now, about the girl. I needed that. Well, the well, girl about... catching the job. This Where? is my job. I fish. I get money. I get wine. So, where's the kid? I don't know that. Did you see her? Mm, I have before. When? That's a good question. Dila shakes uh, the bottle. <coughs> uh, what day is it? DM, uh, what day is it? <laughs> <laughs> it's a Tuesday. Is that him or the DM saying it's a Tuesday? That's the DM. <laughs> I, that's me deciding today is a Tuesday. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay, cool. Thank you. <laughs> um <clears throat> I uh, as Tuesday. And what happened then? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You saw her. You saw her. When did you see her? Last Tuesday. What was she doing? What were you doing? I was drinking. I think that's probably and true. Fishing. I'm not shocked by this <laughs> somehow. <laughs> okay, where, what somehow, did she yeah. do? <laughs> did you you said you saw her? Where was she? In the town. 
Where was she in the town? At the end. Where they have wine. And then what happened? She left. Did Where did go she go? Mm, nope. First, my natural 20 inside taking me. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Please. He seems to tell the truth. On a 25. Oh, shit. <laughs> mm. um, oh, wait. The 25. Yeah, I got a 25. Got I got that 20. Sorry. <laughs> tell me if I he's apologize. <laughs> uh, he doesn't appear to be like lying. <laughs> But he doesn't appear to be telling every part of the story. I'll put it that way. How close are we to him? Uh, how close are you to him? Yeah. But since you had, since you helped him get, I back helped up, him in the boat, right? Only like a foot or two away from you. Okay, cool. I grab him by the neck again. <laughs> okay. Let's pause on that for a second. <laughs> Harrigan under the water. Yeah, yeah, what too. what okay. is happening We're with you down there? Because this has been this has well, been probably five minutes or so. I just want to see what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I wanted to interrupt, but I was having fun with your impression. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's a very fun. I love playing drunk characters. They're so much fun. Yes. Okay. Um. So soon after. I managed to pull him out of the water. I imagine I very clearly see him falling into the water, struggling, and Mikael managing to pick him up, and I'm like, all yeah. right, he's fine. I want to look around. Do, do I see the bottom of the lake? Uh, roll perception. Okay. Since you have dark vision now, you can actually see. <laughs> Wonderful. I forgot about yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. Otherwise, you'd be at a disadvantage doing this whole our adventure right now. <laughs> oh man! Oh man! Jeez. I yeah, I have a plus yeah. ten. It's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Expertise and yeah. yeah, handy perception. Uh, you see a little bit, like it's very faint, but you can make out roughly where the bottom is. Okay. How far does it look down? Um, yes, uh, it's about 60 feet because it's right at the edge of your vision. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, noted. Uh, just looking around real quick, I, I assume I could see a, a few fish and all that, but do I see anything out of ordinary, like, uh, like a big fish or maybe a mermaid um, or something. So interestingly enough, yeah. you do not really see any fish around. Oh. Um at least in this area, it's rather devoid of fish. That's um, a little worrying. It's very creepy to you being underwater expecting to see fish and things swimming around and there is nothing. That's a terrible um, thing. Just FYI. It's mm -hmm. right. Um, there's, something wrong. Has there's something wrong. There's something big. There's something big. Yeah. As you're looking around, something on the floor catches your eye, but you can't quite make out what it is because it's, like I said, right at the very, very edge of your vision. Damn, what's the rule uh, casting spells underwater? I don't need to breathe. You still but I can't use verbal. Yeah, because still you can't use. Yeah, verbal. you can't use verbal because even though you don't mechanically need to breathe, you have to inhale and exhale to use words. If you can't, if you don't have breath to exhale out, you can't do a verbal component. Secondary question. Yes. Because this may mm. apply to Harrigan in the future. Anyways, water breathing. Water breathing would allow him to cast spells just like it would allow a normal caster to cast spells. Okay. Oh. No, did is that a spell? That's yeah. surely yes. a spell. It's a third level. 
I, I mean, what? Love. I believe. Water. Correct me if I'm wrong. I wonder why you're asking. Correct me if I'm wrong. Other DMs. I think Waterbrain does allow casting a spell. I would the spell grants up I would to also... ten willing creatures. Yeah. You can see within range the ability to breathe underwater, and the spell ends. Affected creatures also yeah. retain their normal mode I of respiration. Like, if you if you could that. breathe water, you could cast underwater. Yeah, I would. It roll. would feel kind of like bullshit if it didn't. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, right. I feel like that's kind of defeating the purpose of casting yeah. it on so like, many people. Anyways, perhaps it would, it would eventually maybe apply yeah. to Harrigan. Who knows? Yeah. It's still yeah. a question and answer. Ritual thing. spells. How do those work? They take ten longer. minutes, they take on it, ten and it minutes take plus the... the casting time oh. of the action, but they yep. do not cast the spell slot. Yep. Gotcha. But they still have to have it prepared. Yep. Yes. Okay. Yeah, you still have to have cool. it prepared for the day, but it doesn't count a cost count against you as long as you have the 10 minutes plus the time required to cast. Like, if it's casting time a minute, yep. it would that take 11 busted. minutes. Uh, no, it's a way to help save spell slots. Smile. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Water breathing it's also lasts a way to make 24 it... hours, though. <laughs> yeah. But it's also yeah. it's a way to make it worthwhile preparing Gosh. spells that you wouldn't use in combat. Fair. Because like, like in combat, you wouldn't use a spell that costs necessarily cost a way, minute. Noted. Seventy-five is... percent of the druid spell list is very situational. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a way to to give more role play option to spells as well. Because then you're like, I don't want to use this spell slot, but if I can ritual <coughs> cast it, then we can use it for other things. Mm hmm. Anyways, okay. sorry, so Well. Um DM, would you allow me to go surface only only fast enough to go <gasps> get air in? <laughs> if not, that's fine. I understand. What spell are you trying to use, man? I don't have a particular spell in mind. I would just like to have the ability to go, oh shit, I'm out, you know? <laughs> hmm. Oh. Uh, I so see. I guess, it, yeah, I, I guess I should say Misty Step is kind of. Yes, you would only get one spell. Because that's that's how it works. You would have a singular spell, and yeah. in normal cases you'd start drowning. But in your case, you just can't cast anymore. Yeah. So yes, this is weird because you also won't like suffer the pain of holding your breath because you don't need your breath. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of what I was thinking about this is too. Such a weird situation. Yep. So okay. he's a container of air at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Re like you're an air tank. It's weird. My <laughs> lungs literally only serve like as a it, it's almost a vestigial yeah it's almost a vestigial organ if not for my casting ability. <laughs> really uh, kind of yeah yeah this it's is interesting so, weird. so uh in the middle of you guys i imagine holding him up and interrogating him you just hear harrigan breach the water <gasps> carry on <gasps> and dive uh, back under <laughs> okay bye okay okay <laughs> so druids right? we'll come <laughs> back briefly to the altercation on the boat and then we'll go back it won't be so long because i have a feeling i know what heritage <laughs> doing and it may change what's happening either way so okay uh mikael you are scruff of the holding neck holding this man by essentially what is his collar like this to the guy <clears throat> yeah yeah um what are you what are you, doing? what are you doing? What are we doing here? Uh <laughs> Just tell us now the truth this time. 
Roll me an intimidation. Mm. Not bad. Not bad for a charisma based skill for me. <laughs> Let's see. You won't do anything, but I still don't know anything. It is the thing I don't 19. believe you. <laughs> oh, That's so totally fair. I... You can choose not to believe without rolling. Oh yeah, no. I here's the thing. I'm in a situation. I don't fucking believe a word he says, no matter if I rolled an inside check or not. Yep. No. Absolutely <laughs> fair. I that is a hundred percent a thing. This guy's a liar. Look, we're trying oh. to be nice, but we're not going to be nice anymore. Tell us. You are we'll nice. Get... You dump me in water. He, he doesn't, doesn't know that. <laughs> he but can blame us. Right. You are correct. He did not. I... The other yeah, ones is... that came up and started questioning me while I was fishing. And now and all of the water is disturbed. Job. And now all, all of the fish are going to leave. And now it's you're scary. lying. So. And there are clearly no fisher. You have nothing in your boat. That's you really are a horrible fisherman. I was going to catch many times. Uh huh. And the proof of that is. He thought he caught one until it pulled him in. <laughs> <laughs> Did you not see the one that took the my rod? That had think, to be a big one. I think you just fell into the water, <laughs> to be honest. And now you have no rod to fish with. I. You're right. Where did that go? Mm -hmm. I need that. Mm -hmm. Where's the girl? I don't know where she's at. Okay, I dunk him in the water. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. No, fair. Uh, is it like a dunk come up? Or are you like dunk and holding him? I hold him there for a couple <laughs> seconds. It's not long enough to drown him. Uh, yeah, maybe yeah, long I, I enough to get, enough to know. threaten and to shock him but not enough <laughs> yeah, to like yeah yeah we're not trying to hurt actually him necessarily in any like way. waterboard him just you know yeah. get him a little you freaked out, are you out. Sure he is lying this is extreme if he is telling the I truth i think are he is sure? lying uh I mean, when you do <laughs> all right well that happens that was the funniest <laughs> noise i've ever made uh, ten out of ten. it was so good good, good. <laughs> yes <laughs> Oh, my lips feel weird, though. That was a weird... A great episode already. So many It was a weird way of <laughs> making the... All right. Hair gin. Wow. Yes. That... Because it doesn't take you long to get to the bottom of the lake. Um, You... Because I'm assuming you're swimming down to the bottom. I'm assuming that's why you wanted to get out of jail card. Yeah, yeah, just in case. <laughs> I, I'm assuming I could be wrong. Yeah, I could be wrong. I'm just assuming. Mm. All right, what are you doing? Are you going to go look at the thing that was catch your eye, or are you just wandering around down here trying to see what might be down here? I'm gonna see what caught my eye before I start wandering. Okay. That's fair. Um, as you begin to get closer. Roll me an investigation check. Guidance? That's verbal. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. If Probably you'd have done it before you went back down, you yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, no. The 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 bad thing is I was thinking about it. It would have been so much better if you just see Herjin pop up, he looks over. And just goes guidance on Mikhail before just dipping. 
<laughs> that would have been amazing. Yeah, yeah. All right. <sighs> Investigation. Um, as you begin to get closer, um, it's hard to tell exactly because dark vision is in black and white grayscale. Um, it looks to be almost like a rock. <laughs> um, but as you get closer, you notice that it is a bag. <gasps> no. Is it like just kind of chilling on the surface of the just, ground? Yep, it is just sitting on the floor of the lake. Hmm. Okay, I will walk over and uh, pick it up. I need a strength check. Oh, oh boy. As you get closer, you notice it is a rather large sized bag <clears throat> oh oh this is not gonna go well for me hmm. mm -mm. you try to move it and it just doesn't budge hmm. uh, i need to see here we go with another wild shape let's see what happens now <laughs> <laughs> Crocodile 5e has yep. a strength of plus two. <laughs> yup. Hmm. Problem is, it has hold breath. It can hold its breath for 15 minutes. Wait, I can't cast spells in. Uh, that's not a spell. Wild Shape is not a spell. Wild Shape is, is a class feature. You can just do it. Oh. Correct. Oh. When you get two per at your level, right? Yeah, you get two like permanently unless you're uh, circle the, the moon. Yeah, yeah, right. So you have a couple. circle the moon. Get like or have five. Other bullshit. Or have other yeah. bullshit. Yeah, that too. Yeah. magic items. Smile. Swim of thirty feet. Uh, yeah. Let's let's turn into the crocodile. There goes my wild shapes. Effective use of them, arguably, though. I don't know well, about the first one. The fish, yeah, the fish kind of got hey. borked. <laughs> In a way, yes, but you were still able to influence what happened, nonetheless, yeah. because of it. Yeah. It just, rolls-wise, didn't work for you as well as you wanted. Yeah. Oh, well. All right, I'm a crocodile. I have a plus two to right. strength. Uh, do they yeah. have for athletics? Oh, athletics. Hold on a second. Skills, athletics. Uh, uh, it's uh, skills as uh, plus two to stealth. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I thought the squid or the octopus had something for that. Yeah, well, octopus are <coughs> no. dexterous. Yes. Uh, with a 10, it's still a little heavier than what you're capable of. You're, you're able to kind of lift it a little bit um, with the 10, but it's not enough to be able to pull it to the surface. Mm. Can I use my... Maybe I shouldn't. I was going to say, I could use my teeth and try to, like, rip the bag open and see what it is, but maybe... Maybe the bag is the good thing. Is it is it like tied closed or it is, is tied it... shut? Uh. Oh, no. Uh. Uh. OK, well, before I do anything else, I want to do another quick look see around uh, what's going on. Anything trying to sneak up on me? Um, I do not I have around, there is there is nothing that you can see. <sighs> okay. Interesting. The crocodiles don't have dark vision. 
Yeah. yeah. No. That's, That's weird. Wild. That is weird. Hmm. DM, can I grapple objects? I just want to bite the bag. Are you going to do a death roll with this thing? What are you thinking? <laughs> uh, technically, maybe. Um... Yes. Okay, so with my large jaws, I go up to the, the bag and I bite it and I want to try to swim upwards. Okay, I mean, you. It, so it's not so much of a grapple as my mechanic wise goes. Uh, yeah. But like, I mean, for flavor, we can do it. So go ahead and give me another strange check, but at advantage. We'll do it this way. Okay. Because you're not, you don't technically Plus grapple two. objects. 19. A 19. You are able to grab a hold of the bag and begin swimming your way up to the surface. Um, okay. And uh, hold on. I know it's almost Christmas, but whatever is in this bag also feels like Christmas. It could be mm. anything. I think it's Oh, a yeah, body. you totally didn't find a body. You totally yeah. didn't find a body bag, man. Yeah. Like, oh, totally not. It's what you found, diamonds. what mm -hmm. you found was buried treasure of Strahd. For we sure. Just got, we just got the mother load of diamonds and gold, so and we never, so we never have gold. to do any adventuring ever again. We could just retire. Like, yeah. yeah. Truly, that's what you found. Yes. We don't even need yeah. Strahd's diamonds. We'll find our own diamonds. Yeah, our See, diamonds I'm will just be better. <laughs> I'm, I'm just waiting for uh, DM to go. All right. So the mimic that you have in your mouth <laughs> is now biting you. <laughs> <laughs> When the bag uh, back. Okay. Damn, I don't have a level <laughs> moonbeam for that. I mean, oh, a man, level moon darn. Beam. Uh, <laughs> all right. You know that's going to happen if you throw a mimic at us. I'm throwing whatever large spell I have. I got. I don't care. <laughs> Why would I throw a mimic at you? To torture me. You're right. <laughs> I was like, mm, because you can. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah. Why wouldn't like, you? Is the better question. Is there another question. reason other than you can? <laughs> um, the better question is why wouldn't you? <laughs> it's a great question. Hmm. Um, hmm. All right, so you surface with this bag um, as a crocodile. So you have a bag now in your mouth as a crocodile. Uh, the rest of you. See a crocodile appear uh, out of the water uh, with uh, a bag in its mouth. Mikhail, uh, are crocodiles in this lake normally? I don't know. <laughs> For flavor, because I can. You know how Flor Floridians uh, <laughs> say uh, alligators and crocodiles are just swamp puppies. Uh... My alligator form looks like it's doggy paddling and its tail is just kind of wagging. <laughs> <laughs> Look what I found! <laughs> so we see a weird crocodile swimming towards us. You see a doggy paddling crocodile who is waving its tail in the air. Um, do I know it's Terrigen? <laughs> I, with that insight... <laughs> no, it's not. Zila, you think it's just a weird crocodile. <laughs> okay, I know. Uh, the rest of Mikael can I, probably figure out his hair. I think that's his okay. I don't know why. Oh, I'm good. <laughs> Zofi to too. Yeah. Oh, you know. You I think I... <laughs> yeah. He's done weird things in animal shape before, so yeah, you would... 
you would put two and two together. Do I see? Even him. Do I see the bag? I think it is him. Uh, uh, at, yeah, as he gets a little bit closer, you do see a burlap burlap sack in his mouth. I'm going I look over to at the... start loading the bag up towards us if he allows it to release from his mouth as he feels a tug. Yeah, the second I feel it tug, I'm going to just... What's your ah. weight limit? Oh, God, I can do a medium creature, so let me check my weight limit. Okay, you're good. I, I mean, so that basically towards... means you can go up to, like... I can do I can do one pounds. large creature right now, I think. Oh, yeah, what? Yeah, so you, you've got, oh, like, you 500 pounds, too. roughly. No, That's crazy. <laughs> I, I I'll get you the towards... exacts. Hold on. I look towards the fisherman to see if anything has changed, demeanor, anything. Um, no, aside from the fact that he is trying to catch his breath from having been dunked under water, because essentially he comes out of the water only a second or two before Harrigan comes out of the water. So he is still trying to catch his breath from having been dunked under the water. I lock eyes with me, Kale. Yeah. I think I unceremoniously dropped the guy in his boat. <laughs> okay. Uh, Ow. Hmm. Yeah. It seems you really haven't pulled us anything that was through over here yet. Mm. And no one should talking about. Is this Look bag yours? Over Does this here. To you? Tell the truth now. Can I nope. growl? <laughs> you can like hit. I mean, hiss. I can hiss. Crocodiles yes. Hiss. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> it's like a. Yeah, they kind of go to. Yeah, I, I, yeah, yeah. They're reptiles. Yeah. They hiss. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but so... it's very it's, it's a very scary hiss though. It's like, very scary. It, it's I walked guttural. by yeah. one. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, it's very guttural. <laughs> so the, the math doesn't work out on this homebrew thing because I can pick up a medium creature, but straight carrying capacity is 108. The math isn't mathing. That is not math. <laughs> so I okay. Not, works, the, here's yeah. here's how I think of how that works. To me, the carrying is a over a period of time. What is the weight can you carry? If you're just picking a person and throwing them, True. it's a little bit easier to do. Because uh, the way it's calculated easier is to your concentration. Esper level times. Oh, actually, sorry, I under undershot that. Hold on, that might be why. Because it's Esper level. It's two times. Sorry, two times int score, which is eighteen times. Two times which level, is which is six. <laughs> Two hundred and sixteen. That math is mathing. Okay, that, that makes, makes more sense. sense. Okay. <laughs> um, but I still picture it as like, you know, like if you in a pinch need to like lift something real quick, you can lift something for a few seconds. That's heavier yeah. Than you normally that could, makes sense. But you can't carry that that long. Yeah. So that's how I picture that working. Um, it's your ability to maintain the concentration on the heavier object. Um, but yeah, with the 200 and whatever it was, yeah, that's not a problem. Yeah. Yeah. Do you allow it to free from your mouth? Yes. Okay. I thought it funny your feet just because went Because I already hissed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you hissed at the, the man, so you didn't right. have it yes. in your mouth anymore. No. Okay. Uh, I'll float it over to our boat. Okay. Question... Uh, Yes. Is it body shaped? Is the bag body shaped? Mm -hmm. No. We're not looking at a body bag. We really did find the treasure of Strahd. Huzzah! So I just to open it. Bag. You were oh, oh. He said no, and then some. It must, you must have heard. They said nope. Okay. Um. I'll kind of land it. What did he find? down there and I'll start opening it. I want to know what's inside too. As you open it. Uh huh. Uh -huh. You begin to see an arm. And uh -huh. another one. Oh, that's why it's not. And you begin to see 
the body of a child matching yep. the description that you were given. Yep. Motherfucker. I'm climbing yeah. up on this man's boat. <coughs> As a crocodile? <laughs> yes. Do it. Um, give me a dexterity check as the crocodile. Uh, that's a straight roll. No. Motherfucker. You attempt to crawl up on the boat so and it does not work. You Upon can't quite get your stubby little arms bag, up onto the... I would hop over to his boat and, like, try to take it over. I was just gonna try to do the same thing. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you can hop over... He's not resisting. He's still kind of, like, on his back after Mikhail unceremoniously basically threw okay. him back on his boat. So we found the body of the girl we've been asking you about. Underneath? Wait, Herogen? Underneath the boat? Not if you... Yes? Somewhere near? Okay. Yes, <laughs> underneath the boat. Smack, um, smack, smack. Yeah. Somebody <laughs> wants to talk to you, I'm sure, about this whole situation. You're going to come with us, and we're going to bring you back to him. To have, a, have a conversation. We need to Bye. find him. Let's get him to land first. Yes. I'll start I boat. have, I have rope. Back. I think I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna jump in the boat with you with to <laughs> sure. Dorosta just so there's two people on him. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. He's, you know, too, just yeah. I know he's not gonna try down anything, but in the boat if where he did. you dropped him. <laughs> yeah. I will. One of us can row, and the other can float, <laughs> grapple the limbs yep. back yeah, in and tie it back shut. Them. I have, I mean, I have uh, the, it was not dismembered. Oh, oh. I'm just saying, as you start opening the bag, you start to see them like appear in the bag. Gotcha. As you were okay. She's very um, much not breathing, though, is she? No. Yeah. <laughs> I will watch. Um, How? Uh, um... I, I will roll the boats, Mikhail, if you want to watch. <sighs> okay. I just like okay. straight up. Weird. Do I have rope? Um... <laughs> Medicine check. How decayed does the body look? How bloated has the body become? Roll me a medicine check. I'm going to have the weirdest search history today. Oh, God. Uh, no, I am very unfamiliar nope. with you fleshies. Great, and... I don't have to have my yep. FBI agent wondering what I'm looking at <laughs> things for. Mine's a minus one. You don't make to roll that. No. Okay. I don't want to know. No. <laughs> No, on on either of those, you're not gonna, you're you're not familiar with. While you may be familiar with dead things and dead creatures, mm -hmm. how time and such in the water because water messes with the way decay works. It's yeah. not yeah. something that you can mm -hmm. you've ever encountered or had a reason to, so you don't know. Nope, not my race. All right, uh, <laughs> I'm hopping back in. Um, I will drop the wild shape. Uh. I assume I see you inspecting the body, right? You Essentially, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'll plop beside you and be like, hmm, what you checking for? Uh, to maybe see how long she's been down there. But I'm not familiar with um, humans. And that. Ah, um, Sila oh. has a very dark look right now. Let me uh, take a look. Damn. Hey, yo. I'm sorry, <laughs> DM. <Okay>. Hey, yo. <laughs> <laughs> Get that search history. Get that search history going. Hey, FBI <laughs> agent, you got a really weird search history today. <laughs> Hi, FBI agent. It's my it's fault. Like you have to deal with this. <laughs> Um, you know, improv it or something. If you want. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, from what I remember <laughs> from forensics, <laughs> uh -huh. um, it depends on because the water is cold, the yeah, preservation of the body would cause it to decay slower but the fact that it was in water but there was no fish around and there was and a not bag, exactly so it was protected regardless yeah and not necessarily any bacteria could get in there 
uh, nor any kind of flies or maggots or anything like that. So it's yeah, probably so it would be like bloaty, probably. But if she was dead, okay, like bloaty. So I definitely and probably like bluish, yeah. bluish. So I definitely found strong. like a scholar paper on this. So it looks like I was doing research. Uh, oh, <laughs> nice. I found like yes. a. I found it from a college. It was a research paper. Great. Uh, cool. <laughs> um. The way the decomposition works in water is it is slower because it is cooler and you don't yep. have the oxygen yep. affecting it. Mm. Yep. Also, because there is not fish and things here, you don't have anything consuming it. Yep. So it is somewhat bloated. Not, you know, not massively, but like... Rigor mortis definitely set in. Yes, rigor mortis oh, has yeah. long since set in. That's a that's just a fact of the body. Um But there's not a ton of bloat because there was not a huge drastic change in pressures. Um because it was underneath the water under pressure. Um <clears throat> there was not a ton of decay, so she looks like it, this was relatively recent. Uh, that this happened. Uh, with a 27, you would be aware of those factors. You would be aware that the that the uh, water itself likely preserved the body. So it's hard to pinpoint exactly when she would have died. But you estimate it to be sometime within the last week. With a 27, could I recognize what might have killed her um she seems to be kind of blue in the face so you imagine she drowned gotcha hmm well probably been here for about a week looks like she was drowned right so when you last saw her apparently Ah. You know, I almost felt bad for pulling you into the water, but now I really don't. You're kind of a piece of shit. That was you. Uh, yeah? Did you not see me transform from a crocodile to a rabbit? I thought I was seeing things. That's cool. <laughs> oh, thank you. Maybe you're not such a bad man. I think he I is still a bad you. man. Yeah, he's still a bad man. I'm just, I'm just kidding. So, uh, what do we do with this guy? Tie him up, bring him back. We're taking him to his, to the child's parents. We're taking yeah. interrogate him from there, I assume. This oh, time we'll do with him what they will. He won't talk to us about anything, so you know. Well, hmm. I've got to ask at least this much. Why? Why Why kill this poor innocent girl? I didn't kill her. The Vistani are lucky. And so I Talk. dropped I, I her in the lake. And the fish would come. You are a God damn idiot. You know there's not a single fucking fish down there? Not not a one. It's honestly scary how barren this lake is. That's cause she wasn't good enough. I kick him. <laughs> Guy. Honestly. That one. Are you, uh, okay. Uh, Important question. Are you kicking him to injure Sila? him or just thematically? I want him to shut up. <laughs> okay. I don't want to kill him. I don't want to hurt him that bad. Okay. I'll no, let no, that's the fine. Just, kill him. It was more of I'll is this just... mechanically going to happen or is it just thematically no, not, you're kicking I'm not him to shut trying up? To do okay. like 2d6 damage or whatever. No, that's. I just want to clarify. <laughs> I would have healed him too. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Who's sitting? I was thinking about that. Who's too, sitting yeah. in the boat with Zila? 
I would have gotten in your boat. Thank uh, everyone right. except for me and the rest. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Would you guys like to do a perception check? <laughs> sure. Okay, I'm going to do a deception on my end. <laughs> Ooh, got to beat that. Good, good, nice. Yeah, nice. no problem. Good, good, Easy good, clap. Nice, nice. Good, good, nice, nice. You guys <laughs> see her eyes start to glow and things start to slide, like little loose bits here and there around the boat start to float up. A Makes bit. sense. I'm used to seeing <laughs> yeah, this. The ripples going out from the boat. Yeah. Zila. Let them deal with him. We can't bring back a body and nobody. We'll get blamed. The ripples calm, but the eyes still glow. <laughs> Fair. Fair. Personally, uh, I wouldn't mind seeing his arm get bent out of shape, out of let's nothing. Let's just make sure he gets back to the Vastani in one piece. Whatever it is, he I don't care if you knock him out, made, though, Mikael. No, I think I want him conscious. <laughs> All right. So you guys make your way back to shore, where you are greeted by the NPCs, who have just been kind of like... They've been trying to watch to see what happens, but, like, you're 400 mm -hmm. feet out into the water. Yeah, you know. It's confusing. Um, Zila's so not hiding her expression. <laughs> they've seen a lot of splashing mm -hmm. and are very confused. Yeah, rightfully um, so. What, what's happened out there? We found the girl okay. dead in the bag underneath the water. I Herodin. found the girl dead. Sorry, Herodin oh, found the my. girl dead. Um, Irina kind of does the like, you know, like covering <laughs> the, the, the her noble. her. Oh, no. yeah, the the yeah. noble. Oh no! The very yeah, the very noble like. Oh, no. Um, as oh, Rel no. does like. <laughs> roll, roll, uh, roll insight into Esmeralda. It's love not a hard roll, to, but but I would love to. Oh my god. <laughs> Maybe, maybe still, maybe still. Yes, even with it was only, you only had to beat a five. Never she's yeah. not. not a hard roll. Cool. Like, she's sorry, not. My dice roll bad. <laughs> yes, it, it was not a hard roll, but she is somewhat trying to keep composure. Yeah. Um, you can see that she's very angry and is not does not look very. Uh, She's in a very good mood right now. Cool. Um, <laughs> and looks like Jeez. she might be ready to end this dude. She's not. She's not. She's the not only making one. a move for her weapons. <laughs> She's not actively making any aggressive movement. But she looks like if he does anything, I will chop his head off. Yeah. There's rope around somewhere. We all I mean, you guys Zilla have rope. Ate, like, Between us, we have rope. Yeah. I yeah, mm -hmm. start uh, tying yeah. him up. Zilla he got brings out the rope and adventure just packs, tosses things it. like that. Yeah, like he's got it. Between all this, yeah. surely there's rope. Yeah, I fucking hog tie him. I don't even want him walking. I'm just gonna put him over my shoulder. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> um. All right. Uh, so you guys begin to make your way. Uh. That's the wrong map. Uh, begin to kind of make your way back toward Vlaki uh, on your way to the Vasani camp. Now, are you going through Vlaki or are you going to go around Vlaki? Let's go around. That'd be look weird. If we had around, 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 around. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, you know, on top of that, on top of that, pass without a trace. Fuck anyone catching yeah. us walking around with it's this. So we are a bunch of a dead body and a live body. Weird. Yeah. No, 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 no. People. <laughs> okay. We yes. do not need a overzealous guard. <laughs> don't give us a yeah. don't give the reason to arrest us. Holy cow. Yeah. So. Uh give me um stealth checks. Don't forget to add your plus ten into miscellaneous yep. before you roll. From the Skills. 
I assume I you wanted know. everyone. I see. Yes. Thank God I had the fucking plus ten. Half plate is. Look at me! Oh my god. <laughs> All right, time to net one. Oh my god. Sorry, two seconds. Hey, look at us be stealthy. <laughs> Look at those nat 20s. Yeah. Good. It's good thing my nat 1 had yeah, a plus okay. 10 to it. Why did you say that? Oh. Why I, did okay, you I rolled a nat 1. I said it because I rolled it. <laughs> no, you brought it over to me too. Well, it's okay. add 10, it's so okay. it's a 14. Uh, By the way, uh, before we oh. start. Oh. oh plus 10. Oh, it's still a 22. Yeah. It's 22. still a 22. That's still, that's still good, considering. Pass um, that a trace is before, 20. <laughs> before I cast this spell, I do want to uh, bring up... We should probably make sure that man can't speak. Anyone have a sock to stuck in his mouth? Sure, we gag him too. Oh, yeah. Good. Okay. Also, as a side note, just imagine... I have manacles. We what are we doing? <laughs> we could have just used those. I didn't want the manacles. <laughs> Let's, Let's some smooth. waste on Let's him. Be okay. That's too <laughs> dignified for this man. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hell, we could throw him on anyway. Just for a good measure. Okay, <laughs> okay. You guys so far outnumbers the nat ones and such. It's not even funny. Um, I think Zila and Harry. The average alone. is still like twenty-seven. <laughs> yeah. um, High five, by the way, Joe. <laughs> yeah. Every every twig you guys step on, Zila and Harrigan both simultaneously. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> okay. Um. You guys begin to make your way. I'm going to do some rolls for a city to watch. You know, as much uh, as we wanted to hurt this man ourselves, just think, the second we saw the leader, he was already kicking the man who uh, let this poor girl out of his sight. Just imagine what he's going to do to this one. Oh yeah, no, this oh, guy's fucking that's why dead. That's bringing him back to him. Yeah. <laughs> Like, Zila we just continues this. to have a very dark look. <laughs> like, okay. if at the very least we can give him this, you know, we cannot bring back his daughter alive, but we can do this. He can give him his vengeance. Uh, you guys uh, begin to kind of make your way around the town. Um, uh -huh. To make your way back to the Vastani camp. Uh, Let's right now take a quick bio break. <laughs> okay, oh, okay, 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 okay. Maybe because I need. We you. weren't good enough. We weren't good enough, Joey. <laughs> you know, I was thinking <laughs> totally about this fine. too. You probably would have been fine without my bathroom, real quick. Mm -hmm. Summon Tan Tan out of sight or something, and then come back. You know. We just did everything right then and there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes, you guys did. I, I mean... It worked out. It worked out wonderfully. And it gave yeah. some privacy to the conversation until we decided to move it to a different room. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Celtic. Ghost looks like he's busy doing something. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Trying to do something. Setting up our combat arena. Yeah, setting up the combat arena. <laughs> At least let's try to be diplomatic, man. We can do it. I promise. We can do it. I can talk. I promise. I can guidance. <laughs> <laughs> you guys got this. Yeah, Zila and Zofi are just gonna stay quiet. <laughs> mm hmm. I can help. You know. <coughs> Never mind. Never mind. 
Um, you remember our conversation? If if you speak it, it it becomes true. Oh yeah, right. please don't. No, please yeah, don't. no. Please don't. No, I don't feel like <laughs> cursing. Uh, no. Thank you, thank you. Mm -hmm. I appreciate. Big preach. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. I can't explain. I can explain this much. It's it's bad juju to go. Wow, it sure is quiet around here. Ah! Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Joey. Yes. Why did you do that to me? You know. Nah, never mind. I deadass forgot that that's the exact phrase. Yep. Why, why, why oh. did you do that to me? Oh. <laughs> What's the phrase? Oh, it's just why so, it's just, it's just me? so, it's so stereotypical. That's the perfect example. What? Yep. Uh, tomorrow's gonna be hell thing. now. What? No, you're, I you're said fine. a thing? You're fine. No, Who? I said the thing. It's okay. Oh, said the thing. It's okay, Mira. It wasn't you. It was me. I'm gonna have hell tomorrow. What did he say? Uh, I... Why what is it gonna make say? your tomorrow? <laughs> I'll explain on Monday. Okay. Why Monday? Because then she's safe. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Your other campaign. No. We're not playing this weekend anyway. We're not even playing this weekend. <laughs> oh. Then this why? This has absolutely nothing to do with D&D. &D. Oh. <laughs> Alright. I am eating celery and dipping it in hot sauce because I want crunchy and all right, spicy. Alright, Irina's ready. He's put up all 25... Uh, <laughs> Guard that's coming kind of after us. All, us. All, all, all we ask is that you <laughs> let us try to be diplomatic. <laughs> you don't know uh, what's yeah, happening. Yeah. Could be anything. Right. Yeah. So you guys are nice. nice. You got a gift to the Celtic. You received. Uh, I, I did not put your token back on that map. No, <laughs> mm. it's been the theater of the mind a little bit. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, we've been walking around the town anyway. Yeah. We might not yeah. even just be on this you. map. Why would, why would yeah. we be that close to the town? <laughs> I just play. I just stuck you onto the map. That's all I did. Just got to be somewhere. Mm hmm. All right. So, as you guys are... Um, making your way around the town through some of the various fields um, and whatnot that kind of populate uh, this area. Oh. Uh, Is that so Celtic? Which one? Um, you, uh, why is this green? Oh, Melody, I see. Um. Uh, you guys <clears throat> making your way around the town, trying to stay out of sight. Uh, the oh, there's city your guard. Chill. Tom. The few that you see don't seem to make notice of you at all. Um, because stupidly high checks. Yay. Yay. Um, Yay. Okay, we did it, Harrigan. Woo! <laughs> yeah. See? <laughs> um. You guys didn't make it easy on us, though, two now once. <laughs> <laughs> It wasn't my fault. Harrigan made it possible. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Yes, he did. Um, I have my moments.
you guys begin to uh, kind of make your way um, around. And as you are I'm getting around, um, you see a person coming walking towards you. Um, and as they get closer, you recognize them. Ah. Uh. Oh. Great. Um. Okay. Okay. Um. Um. You see, Von Richten. Are we still stealthing? Um, or are we going to say hi to? <laughs> so this is this an this is an actual <laughs> portrait that I made. This is not the game's portrait, mm -hmm. obviously. Right. <laughs> um, because they don't have one when he's in his vampire monster slayer costume yeah this is a real oh. pity uh so i went in and made one because uh, i wanted one because he's cool uh he is cool he's got the uh, belts so, for it hmm. well you can't see the back but on the back he's got like stakes and things which is where some of the belts are is to, to strap equipment to i see um so he actually, he's not an anime protagonist with belts for days for no reason. Uh, <laughs> he has actually served purposes. Boo. Um, uh, and you guys are, are kind of making your way through and you know you catch him to the glance and you're like, okay. And he starts walking towards you all. Does he have any kind well, of expression or okay. Yeah, he looks he looks just completely serious the same way he was when you left. Like did he notice us? Uh he he looks to be because he's walking straight towards your group. <laughs> uh because Von Richten is very perceptive. Um uh well Last I left you all, you were going to the Vastani camp. Now you're coming from the lake. Hi, yeah, so we did that. We went to the camp. And you're we sneaking the through camp. the city with a, well, around the oh. city with a man hogtied on your shoulder. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Correct. Care to explain? He killed the little girl. We have the body too, right? We also have yeah, I yes. assume. Yeah, we have to. Okay. I see. <gasps> um, let me. Do you mind placing her down? Sure. Why? I wish to cast a spell called. So Are you going to let her? She's me already do this or not? dead. <laughs> what is he gonna do to her? I don't know. Burn the corpse. I don't know what he's going to burn the corpse. Is she a vampire? Not that we know of. Then She's I probably, probably don't need to burn the corpse. Great. Okay. Um. So you do you lay her down? I put or the body bag down. Are you bag still persisting down. on holding on to her and not letting him near? I put the body bag down. I float it down, as I imagine I was just okay. carrying it with telekinesis. Probably. Okay. Um. So he's going to walk over, open it up. I see. Um, would you mind giving me a hand with this? Um, Who's he looking at? Just toward the group in general. I mean, what do you want us to do? Well, we, I would like to get the bag off of her and rigor mortis to set in, so that's not the easiest thing to do by yourself. Oh, okay. that's fair enough. Yeah, I'll help. Yeah. Um, 
I will help Zilo you. Zilo will watch intently. Okay. Um. This, this dude, man. Um. Game. Um, where's it at? He is going to walk over to the body and reach into a pocket on his side and pull out a diamond. Huh. Let's see. How long has she been dead? About a week. Hmm. Let's see. Not to change the subject or anything, but what are you doing out here? To be honest, I was following you all. You're uh, just not very perceptive. I take offense to that. <laughs> he has a ridiculous bonus to stealth. Why it, 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 it's... be following us around? <coughs> well, I frown in my observance. <laughs> um. <laughs> yes, I know. He be your observant. I know. Um, it's okay. Which is not easy to do because actually yeah, Harrigan actually. has a higher passive. I than know you, do. you have to beat two. Uh, of that's us. even a, it's hard to beat any of y'all's. <laughs> um, <laughs> I had to do some roll. I did rolls off, like between streams. So I was like, okay, I need to set this up. Um, all right, let's see. I do. No, that's not going to work. Let's see. Ooh, Ray's dead should work. Um, He's going to place the diamond um, on her and is going to cast the spell Ray's dead. Um, you guys have seen this cast. Shit, dude. Uh, did, before you wouldn't do that. you know, Von Richten's a cleric. Qu kind of. Ooh. <laughs> Interesting. Um, kind of. Well, you saw him do remove curse. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. fair. I mean, he's an NPC. They don't really have a class. Yeah, he's... Um, you know. But, I he's mean... He's a purifier. He's a monster hunter. Is is technically yeah, yeah. him and Esmeralda share a lot of things. She doesn't. Yeah. She's not as powerful as he is, though. Feels good um, for him to have cleric stuff. Yes. Um. And so he's going to, uh, go down and put put it, his hands on her chest. Um. He does not say any sort of prayer or anything like any of you would have seen a cleric do. He just simply silently does the verbal component of the spell. Um, and you see the diamond kind of almost shatter over her um, and kind of fall down almost like a sparkling um, coating over the body. Um, and... Uh, You wait for a minute, two minutes. He continues to sit there and just observe until eventually you just see the faintest little of the chest as you see just a little bit of breath. Shallow, but you see breath start to return to the body. Wow. Well... She'll be tired for quite some time. 
Can Remind I me to call you if Harrigen dies. Please don't. I only... I don't have that many diamonds. Especially not of that power. Those are expensive. If we found more diamonds, then we could do it. If you find more, sure. As long as you're paying for it, sure. That is so... magic, though. It is very... <laughs> wow. Okay. Very impressive. Why did you do this for us? What do you it wasn't for you, it was for her. Good. And why do Zilla's it for her? Just, Zilla's just staring at the kid. She's a child. I may not like the Vastani. Or at least not trust them that much. Doesn't mean I want to see a child dead. That's fair. Yeah. If only you realized the piece of shit reason why. That being said, would you rather us tell the truth to the man we're returning this daughter to? Or say that we found her alive? Alive. Because this man over here, he's going to tell her he killed her. Well, no, because he did not even believe he killed her. That is not, isn't exactly believable. He's confused. Maybe he thought it was a week ago, but he did it this morning. And we happened upon her right in time. Yes. I don't think we want anyone to know that any of us uh, have that sort of ability. I'd prefer you don't. It's already risky enough doing that, let alone, you know, letting the Vastani know that there's somebody in town that can do that. I mean, we could even say that she was dead and I did something. Like, that is fine with me, but it would keep, keep That's possible. If you want to well, do it that route. Dead. Either that, or you could... Another way you could go about it. You could turn him into the town and take her back to her family. The father's going to want to see the kidnapper. Well, it's going to be easier telling them that you found the kidnapper. And here he is. And risk him saying everything that happened. Or simply saying that you found her alive at the lake. I have a better What's idea. It's going to be the easier option. I have a better That's idea. Right well, okay, let me backtrack. Better might not be the best word for it. No, it never it's, is uh, with you, is it? Certainly <laughs> not the most heroic idea dead man tell no tale he tried to kill her we had to stop him i wouldn't go so far as to just murdering a man he murdered an innocent girl two wrongs don't make it right my friend no but you're right well let even if you tell Eric. him if you tell the Vastani you turned him into the authorities, while that may not satiate his anger, there's not much they can do toward you or them. I imagine they'll still be grateful enough just to get her back alive. Very quickly. I heave him off my shoulder. I take the gag out of his mouth. <laughs> what just happened? Uh, huh? What just happened? Uh, I don't know. I'm looking at trees. All right. What happened to the girl? What girl? When did you dump her in the lake? I don't know. I, don't I like shove the gag back yeah. in. <laughs> Look, you know what? they're probably going to torture him or whatever. And maybe they'll get a different story out of him. 
But how believable is he going to be, really? What's your point? Plus, being honest, I don't think that you can walk up there with her, with her alive, and you take a drunkard to them. And he says he killed her. Who are they believing? He, she's right there. Yeah, that's. I don't <laughs> quite think that they're going to, uh, like, buy the fact that this drunk man managed to catch her and kill her. Let's just do what we are going to do. While you saved her, you caught the wrong person. Sonny are I... sneaky people. There's not... Most of them would not be caught by a drunk man. She's oh. a child. Even Anything a child, is possible. They still have... Even as a child, they still have abilities. You should know that. <laughs> and I know well enough that it's not always enough, huh? Sometimes bad shit happens. A drunk catches you off well, guard. And if fair enough. Kid... All right. Do we care if they believe be us? Worse... <laughs> well, it may be worse for her I'm if my you glasses off. give them the story and he Go tells them the story of how 20s. she wandered into the inn Seven. by herself. And was in the inn around a bunch of drunk people, and then was wandering around the city all alone and got herself caught. They already Look. knew she wandered off. It's your choice. You can do what you want. I'm not going to tell you one way or the other. Just I don't like options. what I suggested. I want to From point that out. I don't really want to kill the man. However, I don't think we should kill him either way. No, uh, either way. I think it's just. I, well, you I, gave I, him to the Vastani. You may as well have killed him. Yeah, but then we don't yeah. do it. They take their vengeance. They do whatever they want. That's on them, huh? I don't know. I mean, we could bring him to the authorities in the city. With my knowledge of particularly. Uh, whatever their names are that I can't remember right now for some reason. <laughs> the Vistani? Uh, yep. Nice. The, particularly the, yeah, the, Aragal? Aragal. That's, the, that's Aragal. the name that I couldn't remember. Anyway, ah. particularly my knowledge of those two, if I have any. Is it going to come down on her? <laughs> on the kid? Um, for, you know, how bad is it going to be, do I think? <laughs> or are they just going to be like, oh, yay, you're here and alive? You know, on the scale of things. <laughs> From what you would have known <laughs> prior to them being the ones in charge? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I assume um, I just knew them in passing, maybe. Uh, yeah. I don't know. I mean, you would have... I mean, they're not a ton older than you. They're closer to, like, Esmeralda's age. Yeah, So sure. they would have kind of... I mean, in in a sense, you all would have grown up relatively together, but not... Not so that you knew each other, but you would have yeah, but, you know, grown up together. Small enough community, maybe you yeah. know. Yeah. I mean, they were known for being rowdy, but they weren't they weren't unreasonable. But they okay. were always kind of more of the uh act first, ask question after. Sure. Um they did not from what you remember, how they were behaving in the camp is not how you used to know them. Okay. Shitheads, not sociopaths. Yes. But they're it's worse a great now, way maybe. of describing <laughs> them, actually. It's a fantastic <laughs> way of describing them. <laughs> mm. Well, I'll do whatever we decide. I would prefer to bring him to the Vistani, personally. I, I, when she in the camp or the to town? Add his justice into whatever. Sure, the camp. Yes. That is my well, personal preference, but whatever alive, we think is best. Be as, uh, harsh? I don't know. <laughs> the, the issue that I had, and I'll, I'll try to make it more clear. Do you guys think if a group of 
random people, very foreign outsiders, took on a small quest to find your missing daughter. Um, and you found her, or they found her. And uh, you bring back this drunken piece of shit man, and he's saying shit like, oh yeah, I bagged her, threw her in the lake so the fish could return. Do you think you would believe that that is actually the guy? That guy is I mean, very right now, he's not even saying that. That took forever to get out of him in the first place, so... He is more of just saying things like, I don't know, we're about to treat, right? You think he'll think it was us the whole time? It's, it's a possibility. My point is, I don't believe that they'll believe that this is the culprit, uh, that uh, she just happens to survive whatever the fuck he's saying he did to her, and uh, they just take our story. Is it going to be that. in... Sorry. Is it going to be any better if we show up without someone to blame? We have a body to blame. I don't like the idea, and I don't want to push for it anymore. I don't know if I a body is it. better. He needs to pay for what he did, one way or another. We're not this. letting him go. <laughs> no, 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 no. We're not letting the man go. I'm. <sighs> there are three options, Look, I right? I do not want to kill the man. He does... Even that is harsh for him. Yes, I don't want to kill him either. I think we don't kill. Stupid men, fuck stupid. And ruin what is a very great thing you did for this child. Well, you know what? Honestly, either way, you've done a great thing. And it's not ruined. It only ruins our credibility that we are the ones who saved her. We don't have any credibility her. already. Or at least I don't. I. You know what? The spears of shit will just turn into the Vistani camp. And we can pat ourselves on the back for a good <laughs> job. Finding the piece of shit, knowing the truth, and uh, helping a friend out. Not, you know, spreading the word. This man yes. can revive the but dead. We are going to say that she was alive when we found her, yes. Yes. Hmm. Yes, she was alive. He had was dropped her yeah. in the lake, and we jumped in after we her, and we got yes. her out. We got her before she yes. died. Yes, that's just yes. in time. Yes. I just valiantly time. performed CPR and brought her back. Sure, nick yes. of nick of time. Good. Yep. Zilla she was and gone and for but a moment. Also, just... is she does she need healing? <laughs> she like, like one <laughs> no, yeah, uh, she's she's at young. the kid's side. At one okay. HP. <laughs> I'm I'm level three, cure woundsing her. <laughs> okay. Can you walk? Uh, yeah, I used one. Uh, She's she sitting is... up, right? No, she is... You even... said sitting I... up. Yes. Thank you. You just said sitting up. I hope that heals her enough from that. I... As being if I did, I misspoke. I didn't... Okay, I did not you... okay. I said so she's up. laying down. Yes. I apologize. Asleep. If I said sitting up, that was not what I meant. So she's asleep. Uh, yes. She is... Not unconscious because of... Uh... Like, physical damage. Just she's unconscious, unconscious out of asleep. exhaustion. Yeah. Yes. Roleplay unconscious, not mechanic unconscious. Correct. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. How heavy is she? <laughs> Uh, she's only seven, so she's fairly oh, probably easy. eighty I wanna pounds pick her up. or so. I want to pick her up. Can I, I pick her up? I don't know how seven-year-olds are. Can I pick her up? Uh, do, do I have enough strength? Seven-year-old, probably, probably sixty sweet? pounds. I would say fifty pounds. Yeah. 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 On average. Okay, uh, I pick up and carry her. Yeah. yeah, you could you could pick up and carry her relatively easily. Okay, we'll do that. We'll do that. Um, she's not super heavy. As best as she could be healed, she has now been healed <laughs> as best as possible. Okay. Within her current state. 
I'll, uh... You, she is at full health. I hope so, because that's what I'm going to do points. <laughs> yes. For a seven-year-old. Yep. She's a healthy seven-year-old as far okay. as health goes. Yep, perfect. Well, so. Let's Von Richten. Let's get it done. Thank you. Yes. You're welcome. Just and, to be clear, uh, I did it for her. Well, yes, but. Thank you for doing it for her. Exactly. A great thing, truly. It was oh. well done. And also, um. Why are you following us? What, 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 what are you doing? Well, two reasons. One, I wanted to make sure that you guys were doing what you said. Reasonable uh, comes with the territory. All two, right. I wanted to see how competent you all were. I'm going to potentially have help from you guys to do this. I'd like to know that the people I'm going to trust my life with aren't complete idiots. So how did we do so far? Well, you have morals, I can tell you that. Um, as far as actually in a fight, I don't know if you didn't fight. But... Morals, at least, you have those. That's a mm. bonus. That is good. Yeah. Well, I might have uh, made you question them a little bit, but... <laughs> I mean, I can understand where you're coming from. That's the only reason it's not... I get what you're meaning. As long in as a situation like this, home. that may have been a mercy. You're not wrong. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's uh pick up the pace. This spell only lasts an hour. Let's go. Yep. <coughs> We're going. Uh, We're going. All right. You guys begin to make your way. Uh, continue your way down toward the Vistani camp. Um, we zoom. Zoom and zoom and I mean, zoom. I'm fast forwarding. You guys handedly cleared any of the checks of the guards. <coughs> uh, their highest was a 15. Oh. Uh, your average was like a 27. <laughs> if Von oh, Richten yeah. hadn't been following you all, he wouldn't have seen you. The uh, <laughs> only reason he knew where you guys way. were is because he'd been following you the entire time. Yeah. Um. Otherwise, he wouldn't have had a chance to see you either. What was uh, his? What was his stealth roll? <laughs> like twenty uh, something, twenty seven something. Uh, no. So his stealth. Um, he had uh, well, yeah, it was a twenty-one. It was a nat, nat twenty. He has a plus one. Um, his stealth oh. bonus is actually not as high as I thought it was. Oh my gosh! So he just barely. <laughs> he uh, literally oh. only beat it because he hits a twenty. Okay, Harrigan, we don't need to feel so bad now. Yeah. No, uh. he's. Like, he's stealthy for the average person. Like, that would have been hard for the average person to see. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. But you guys aren't average people. No. So, Anyways. harder. Yeah. Bistani um, camp. Yep, so you guys begin to make your way um, to the Vistani camp. Um... I'm gonna bring Everyone, up. be sure you remove your plus ten out of the miscellaneous. For yeah, stealth. and if you if you're worried about the total still being there, just click it real quickly. It'll update. Anyways, 
All right, give me just a second here. I'm getting the Lestani camp map pulled back up here. Ooh, I have that on my bottom bar. I don't have anything on my bottom bar. The last time that I tried to load a map, it broke everything. So I just wait. Uh, oh, there it is. Oh, no walls this time. Yeah. Uh, no, because I'm just putting up the uh, uh, party token. And you guys have seen it. It was more of just the slow reveal of seeing people along the road as you came up that it had the walls in place. Okay. Um, Esmeralda, what are you necessarily... already doing here? <laughs> She's so sneaky. <laughs> she went ahead. Oh, I forgot to delete her token off here. I was trying to delete the whole party. <laughs> I just used the party token because it's like, there's no reason to be individual like there was earlier. Yeah. So I was trying to just use the party token and I didn't get her. Alright. Uh, so you guys begin to make your way uh, toward the camp. Uh, same thing as you guys come walking up. The, uh... Oh, excuse me. The uh, Dusk Elf guards are there at the road. Uh, but this time, seeing you coming in, they don't stop and stand directly in front of you. Um... They, uh, I'm just going to move your token up here because you're going to be up here anyway. Um, they just let you through on the road. Um, oh, on the way, uh, I'm, I'm taking off my staff and, hey, can you hold on to this? Thank you. What? Your oh. staff? Yeah, I don't want the cows to be upset with me. Oh. <laughs> I was like, what? I was so confused. Just making them a coat hanger. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> Here, hold this. I'll be back for it. <laughs> I, yeah, I was so... Yo, I forgot yo. that that was a... I try what to keep it in the back of my mind. Say that, and I forget where that says that. Uh, I, I know it's in the there. I just forgot where it's in. Sculthius staff. Um, Blightbane, when you were attuned to the yeah, staff, it's, Blightbane, nope. Not it's there. evil makes beasts visibly uncomfortable. Yeah. It's evil makes beasts. Yeah, it's near the top. There it is. Yeah, okay. I saw it. Anyway. Um, he'll take it and look at it very strangely and just kind of set it down beside him. Thanks. Um, and he's just gonna, like, he's giving you this look of, like, uh-huh. Like, I don't know why you're asking me to do this. <laughs> um, it's a very confused look. I'm not going but to uh, nonetheless, <laughs> nonetheless, um, you are able to make your way up and around. Um, once again, the uh, captain is up uh, at the top um, as uh, she sees you approach. She and seeing that you have um, the girl with you. Because um, I don't think they gave you a name, if I remember nope. correctly. <laughs> nope. Um, this is a girl. Yeah, no, no, they didn't. They they didn't give you a name. They did not that wasn't important. Um, that wasn't apparently important enough for them. Um, <laughs> or you weren't important enough to them, regardless. Um... Uh, she uh, turns and like gets the attention of one of them, one of the other uh, 
kind of guards around and sends them toward the tent. Um, and uh, comes down to greet, like comes down to you guys. Well, this is a turn of event that I didn't expect to see. How on earth? You know what? I don't even know what. Go talk to them. What's the plan? How? <laughs> She's very perplexed as you walk past <laughs> as to how this random group of people found her when the entire camp of Astani couldn't. Let's see. <laughs> um. You guys uh, make your way up there, and as you get close, um, I'm not going to move them around because thematically they're on the map. You can see them. Um, the uh, I can move them. Yes, okay, because they're not weird. locked tokens. Okay. They're not associated with any character, so they're not locked. They're just tokens okay. on the map. Sorry, I was curious. Continue. No, you're good. You're good. Yeah, I just stuck their, their tokens on the map because there wasn't a reason I didn't need them in the combat tracker at all. Um, because they weren't... Unless you've decided to fight them, I didn't need them in the tracker. They were just icons. Um, it's the same reason you can move the party token around. Because it's just an icon on the map. Um, the uh, tent kind of flies open and uh, Luvash... Um, uh, it comes running out. Um, let me see. Let me get his voice back. Uh, well, this is not what I expected. You found her. How? This entire camp couldn't do that. Zila looks over at Darosta. We were looking around and we happened to see by the lake a boat and this man seemed to be suspicious, so we looked further. We saw then an object with this bag be dropped into the water. So we went to go investigate further, and it turns out that it was her in the bag. We got there very quickly, thankfully just in time to get her out of the water before it was too late. You... That man there. This man we have with us, yes. Yes. I will drop him <laughs> at their feet. <laughs> a little too uh, hard. <laughs> we decided that he'd be, it would be better if we brought him over for you to talk to, or, you know, to turn him into you. What you will. Argo, take care of him. Sure thing. He'll go walk over to the, to the man and um... He will grab a hold um, of uh, of the man and kind of get him up onto his uh, onto his feet and uh, push him toward the tent. Um, Thank you. I don't... To be honest, I didn't expect anything from any of you. So, have this happen is beyond what I thought. I do not often deal with 
outsiders who would willingly do anything for Vasani. Especially not those who used to be Vasani. I won't speak for the others, but I did more so for her. Well, regardless of your motivation, she is alive. That is enough for me. Let me see her. And he'll he'll walk over and take her from you. Gently. Um, <laughs> yes, obviously. Zila will gently transfer. Yep. Um... So as you uh as you hand it over uh hand her over to him he will uh he'll you know very carefully take her in her arms and you will see she starts to stir a little bit um and uh she'll kind of start to open her eyes and and blink a little bit. What just happened? Why are you holding me? Why are you holding me? Uh... Music doesn't set the, the I know the this is <laughs> not a great uh audio choice. I'm just gonna pause it. Um You were asleep, unconscious. These people brought you back. Can you at least sit me down? It's embarrassing. Um I like her. I like her. <laughs> and so he will set her down and she'll stand up you can tell like there's bags under her eyes she's still tired um but like she's awake now um and she'll stand there she'll put her hands on her hips all right somebody one of you guys want to fill me in what's happening Anybody? I don't, know where you, I don't know where you ended up. We found you almost drowned in a lake. She's Vistani, right? Yes. Okay. Do I not look like a Vistani? I, Are you blind? Alright. I just... It sounds like a Vistani. Yeah, no, you're right. <laughs> okay, <laughs> sorry. I just... You are not wrong. You're talking like an adult, and I thought... Never mind. Maybe she has a much What's your point? Who knows? D d nothing. At least somebody here has sense. She's very spirited. That is true. But yeah, we found you. Unfortunately, by some she takes and, after um, her mother. Died. So we found you and saved you and brought you back home. You're welcome. Hmm. I could have handled it myself. Sure. Anyway, I guess I'm thankful. Ah, man, I wonder what happened. Why oh, well. did you wander away by yourself? Just curious. Exploration? Exploring, adventure, wanting to see the world. You know how boring it is in this camp? Oh, you know how very... boring it is at the bottom of a lake? Zila <laughs> shoots. Ar Argo, <laughs> when she says this, Argo. No, no. Arabo. But these people, they just saved you. Be thankful. Eh, I could have handled it. Fair enough. Uh, well, I would believe it. The fact that she's young. acting like this means that she's feeling good. Yeah. Uh, the youthful unfortunately. sounds. Unfortunately, she takes after her mother. Well, 
Well, somebody has to. I like this child. <laughs> <laughs> I like this child. Zila likes this child. I like this child. I love her sass. Gracious. <laughs> All I know is that there's something out there waiting for me to find it. I'm going to find it. Something so probably not the last time I'm going to run off. Just saying. What yeah. something? Oh. Next time be more careful. I don't know. Huh? You ever get that feeling that like there's just something different? You just want to go do something? Maybe wait till you're older. End of. Yeah. I'm seven. Yes, was, I'm no, nearly an adult. I was, I was at least no. 18 or so when, before I had that feeling. Well, you're just old. You're not wrong. Yeah. I'm older. True. Not that old. <laughs> Could have fooled me. Forgive her. <laughs> Apparently, she's forgotten her manners. Let me give you a reward for your efforts. Please come with me. Arabelle, go into the wagon. I don't want to. I was not asking. Okay. She will slink off to one of the wagons on the side <laughs> um because even she knows there's a limit <laughs> um and he will bring you out to a different wagon this wagon contains the treasures that we have gathered uh, throughout our time in these lands and traveling to others. I will allow you the choice to gather uh, hold on I will allow you the choice to choose a treasure you may take as reward. And he will walk up to the door and put a key in and you will hear the lock click. And he will swing it open. And now you'll get to choose your reward. Hooray! Yay. What's available I will to us, read DM? off. I'm going to read off what the items are. Once this is done, we're, we're, we're going to wrap up mm -hmm. here with you guys picking your reward. Um, and if you guys can't decide, we'll give you time to think of it as well. You don't have to necessarily decide today. I, I yep. think it'd be good to yeah. just get a list and I'm going to go sleep. Yep, that's what I'm yeah, going to do. Yeah, good plan. So, yep. you have a wooden chest containing... Twelve thousand, uh, twelve hundred. Um, what is? Hold on, I forgot 1, what this currency is. Gold pieces. Yes. Gold. Gold. Um, hold on. Where is it? Platinum. Gold. Platinum. Gold. <laughs> Platinum. Let's see. Platinum. Gold. Um, Gold. <laughs> mine. Mine. <laughs> iridium. Yeah, iridium. Yeah. <laughs> Mira, is it Mira? Um, arrows? Arrows? It arrows? It is <laughs> about it's, so it's it's not twelve hundred. It's actually it's twelve hundred electrum, which we are not using electrum. Oh fucking electrum. Oh uh, fucking <laughs> electrum. So it is no six hundred gold. Okay. Gold? Uh, okay. Uh, Electrum is one of 50. Houses. Gold is one of 100. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so it's 600 um, electrum or 600 gold. Gee, many Christmas. This is one of the problem when I have to convert numbers. Um, then you have an iron chest containing 650 gold. Don't ask me. It's EP and the GP doesn't work right in 5e. 
Sure. Uh, okay. A onyx jewelry box with a gold filigree. It contains Ooh. six pieces of jewelry Ooh. and a uh, potion uh, of some kind in an unlabeled vial. Ooh. A wooden. Yeah, is it possible to see if any of those are enchanted? Uh, you can give is? me an arcana check. I'm curious about the potion, because I do like... Uh, I would like to check uh, both. Medicine the... or yeah. herbalism? Uh, yeah, you could do medicine, I would think, with this one. This would fall under medicine. All right. Okay. Um, it is... <laughs> yeah. So the... Potion is a poison, actually. Oh. Um, it is a potion of poison. Is literally what it's called. Ah, sick. Right. Um, a wooden throne with a gold inlay and decorative stone. Okay. A rolled up ten foot square rug with a unicorn motif. I love it. Is it a flying um, rug? And then there is the uh... <laughs> yeah, I want to know. If is that's it a flying carpet? It's a flying carpet. Magical. Yeah. There is nothing uh, magical. Uh, in this uh, uh, I don't know. Boo. I think yes. the unicorn is pretty magical. Come I on. look. I like unicorn knights, but it's not magical. Um, also, you're not playing Mirror right now, so. <laughs> and then there's a small wooden box. He says, I don't take those, though. Okay. Okay. Trust me, you don't want them. What is it? Okay. Now I'm curious. It's bottles of water. Oh. Oh. Yeah, sure. Uh -huh. Yeah, is it? I, I don't is care. it though? I don't is, is it? Is it though? Is it's, it? Is it though? It's quite literally okay. Bottles of water. <laughs> oh, okay. They are in potion vials, though. Interesting. But it is quite literally bottles of water. You believed in. I mean, water? to me, it seems obvious. The six hundred and fifty gold. Yeah. Right. <laughs> it, it feels obvious, like, right? Unless, I, I was unless, thinking. Unless there was like enchanted jewelry, but you just said that there's nothing enchanted here. So we get solid gold here. Yeah. I, I, I have a question to ask. Mm hmm. Is uh, the cart on the table? No, this is a cart that we use for travel. Fair enough. Do you have oh, so any extra carts we could take? We can buy a cart with that much gold. With that much money, we can buy a cart, we can buy a horse. Take the money. We don't have to try to sell something. We and don't hope even that we need get... to get a horse. We <laughs> yeah. can just ask Carrie to turn into one. Honestly, yes. We don't need it for so long. A weird potion and then struggle selling necklaces. No, just take the gold. My vote is gold. I, that is that I vote we take the gold too. The six fifty gold. gold. Yeah, yes. because, gold. because why would you take six hundred over six fifty? Well, it, because it's not gold; it's a lack. It's a Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> All right. So, how many of us are there? Go ahead. Uh, one, two, three, four. <laughs> if we divide it by players evenly, it's one thirty each. 120 uh, no 650 divided by five. Oh, i'm sorry i was doing 600 i'm, I'm just gonna s stick it on zila for now because she's the first character i clicked on hey and you guys can if you want to divvy it up you are welcome to do so later where am i looking for the new goal hey it's um, later i'm gonna stick it I'm going to stick it in the EP part, just so you know that that's the different gotcha. money. Hey, hey, cool. um, hey, it's later. Do we all just want to give ourselves one, 130? That, let's I just know. do that. 
Let's just do that. <laughs> okay, All right, give everyone give yourself 130. Cool. Okay, I was... Okay. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> that's fair. No party fund. Plus individual money. No Apparently not. I would like individual money, thank you. Same. I, I had eight gold, man. I had, I had a three. decent bit. I had, I had five, but now I have 150. I had 71. I had eight gold and 29 silver. <laughs> I'm not I had I ten had silver. Jeez, like, guys. I just, I just, I just want. I just want personal okay. spend right. money. You guys have Let's a good night. Here. I'm sleepy. Right. I'm, I'm, I'm tired. Yep, we're gonna end it here. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> right good there night. with you. I need to go to bed. Yeah. See you later, guys. Thank Bye. you. Bye. Bye. Good night. Bye. Thanks for the fun session. Bye. Yeah, good session. Bye.